I think I might need to. Oh, no. Hello, everybody. We are now streaming live. Hello. Welcome to the Sea of Thieves slash We're Live event. I'm joined with first mate Tom. Hello. There's Tom. I should probably introduce myself. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, Tom, go ahead and introduce yourself. Uh, uh, I'm Tom. I work for Rusty Quill, and I've been kindly invited to come and back Casey up in some pirate shenanigans. Um, so, there you go. That was me. And for honor, you're now on fire. <laughs> uh, water. <laughs> water. Uh, so, the water bucket's down here. Uh, here, I'll. Uh, oh, oh, did you just, just jump in the water? Here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I live. I live. I think. Yeah, I'm good. There we go. Okay. Put the fire on the boat, too. Um, so that's the kind of Sea of Thieves shenanigans you might come to expect from our little stream today. So welcome, everybody. Um, if you've never played this game, it's really fun. It uh, allows us to roam the seven seas. We have no idea who's out here, what's going on. There might be other ships, there might not. Um, it's You never know. It's kind of an open ocean. And uh, yeah, for those of you who are joining us uh, first... Uh, we're gonna decorate our boat. This is uh, this is our little captain ship, but we can customize it. Um, so I have my little ship customization here. So those of you in the chat, if you want to jump in and pick whatever you want, I don't know. Can you can you see the options here, Tom? Because if uh, if no one picks, uh, I'll let you pick. Because we have a whole bunch of different uh, okay. little pieces here. Look, uh, it says that you're using the chest. Uh, well, I can't just get the stream open. That's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah, if you look at the stream, you can see it. See. So we got some unicorns, yeah, we got some horse heads, we have, uh, uh, there's demon, there's a whole bunch of fun little stuff in here. Uh, we have lions, we have a... a like the shark one. A sh the shark one, all right. The shark hunter figurehead. Well, because it looks terrifying. Yeah. Great. All right, we now have a shark hunter on our, on our, on our uh, very front figurehead. Uh, all right, now uh, what sh what color should our boat be? We can we can change it here. We have two pages of options. I mean, do do we want to be terrifying? Do we want to be scary? Do we want to to be incognito? Uh, surely blue would be the best option to blend in with the sea, right? Uh, you know, I mean, it's it's all what you want to do. Uh, but if you if you say blue is what you're going for, that's really blue. How how blue. how blue is the ship now? Oh, not that very blue. Okay, that's not too bad. All right, so uh, let's see here. What other ship customizations we got here? We have our sails. Um, we have a whole bunch of different ones here. Um, let's just go with the tattered sails. Hmm. Tattered sails sounds good. Please write a where alive pirate story. Hmm, that's an interesting <laughs> concept. Um, I have no comment Wait, on so that. Does that one. mean zombie pirates? Well, I mean, we do have uh, the sea dogs in the ocean. So, but a lot of the True. open ocean um, is in the We're Alive world is fairly uh, open. So, I mean, there's, there's opportunities I mean, there. Let's be honest. In a zombie apocalypse, the sea is where you want to go, right? Because mm -hmm. like, they don't generally swim. There's some interesting stuff uh, that might be in Scout's honor. Coming up about like, mm. certain pirate things and stuff, so you might, you know, you might get a little bit of some exposure there. Um, uh, let's let's see here. What what little wheel do you like here? Uh, I like the one, and I don't know why, but I like the one that's to the right of the gold one on the second row, so the black one. Oh, the so eye. The left one. Order uh, of Soul. Okay. Looks a bit. Yeah, it looks a bit like a culty. <laughs> Surviving in the I ocean. Have a horrible feeling this ship's going to be like terrifying by the end of it. Just a mismatch, like. Oh yeah, things. I'm sure it will be. That's okay though. Uh, I'm going to leave our our cannons alone because these these actually have like a little bit of a notch at the top, which is good for aiming. Uh, nothing but silicone oh, says okay. surviving in the ocean during a zombie apocalypse was the only good season of Fear of the Walking Dead. I've actually never seen any iterations of Walking Dead, so I couldn't comment. But that's good to know. Uh, all right, so uh, you know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna pick the our capstan for us because literally this one allows us to have a fish on the boat, which I think is kind of fun. All right, okay, cool, cool. There we go. So there is our boat. 
as uh, as decreed by uh, Tom and I, um, it's very I, mismatched. I <laughs> I think it's worth pointing out at this point that, that Casey may be a pro at this game, and I am a beginner, so I am learning as I go. I um, mean, yeah, so I've, so I've you, played you, a little bit. Fun, <laughs> you've got a full set of, like, armor, you're glowing in some ways, and I have, I've got a telescope, though. Oh, yeah, there people can't see me. How, uh, I haven't done rem emotes in a while. Let's see here. So these are all the, the weapons and things. How do you, oh, here we go, emotes, nope. These are how you can chat. Do I really forget how to do emotes? Is it this button, this button, this button? Mm. Ah, here we go. I can, uh, I can dance. So here's my character. I got a beard. I have a, I, I have Spanish armor, if you can imagine, and uh, a little bit of a, a curse on my face. Ta-da! And uh, I mean, you, you look nice. I can also turn into a barrel. Okay, that's just cheating. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, okay, good. Uh, so that's the backup plan, right? You turn into a barrel, and I, I pretend that I'm on my own. And when they board us, you ambush them. They uh, people that's tend to know doing. they're they're on the lookout for mysterious looking barrels. But for people who haven't played the game, yeah. Um, okay, so we have our fish uh, in our little uh, in our anchor here. So we'll just raise anchor. Oh, nice. And uh, where are we going on the Sea of Thieves? Let's check our map. So we didn't throw down a, uh, a quest yet, uh, but we're currently sitting up here at Galleon's Grave. Uh, nothing but silicone asks, uh, Casey, you have a military background, right? I do. Uh, I was in the army for, oh, my contract was a, was it six, eight by two, six by two? I forget which one it was, but uh, I was essentially in for almost a decade. Um, I was a, a sergeant. Uh, served overseas, uh, went to a couple different places in the U.S., and I was in Baghdad for a year. So, yeah, I've had a, a, f a fair amount of uh, adventures in the military, which is sort of a many different inspirations for this, this story. Okay, so our quest is down if you want to vote on it. And we will have a, um, a mysterious man will come onto our bow and tell us, oh, we have to find something. And we're on the quest to, uh, to get the veil. It's good to see so while he's talking, I can actually figure out where we're supposed to go. All right, so we get a, we get a quest book. And we go to the back page. These are all different, so you never know what they're going to be. They, I mean, they, there's some commonalities. Oh! It holds the power okay, the we need to go east of Fetcher's Rest. Ooh, With this power, I think Fetcher's Rest is in the, uh... Ooh, okay. No so and Fetcher's no Rest, more. just to let you know, Tom, is in Volcano right. Zone. This power, the it's in the no, Devil's Roar, so which is the Volcano Zone. So that's going to be safe then, right? Oh, yeah, of course. Of, good, of good course. Right. Of course. Uh, our... All right, southeast. Let's set sail. Retrieve the veil stones, and I'll make sure the veil of the ancients. All right. So the only thing I do remember about this is I need to keep an eye out for, for other people's ships. That's the big thing. Yeah. If we're if we're not looking for conflict, uh, we kind of got a little bit spanked yesterday. Uh, we we tried it out, um, and we got a, a thir three pe person boat was really uh, coming after us. So. That was fun. I, I was gonna, I was gonna say we could have told anyone any story and they'd have believed it. But, but yeah, you're right. Yeah, we, we got a bit sunk. <laughs> <laughs> we are, we are not about right. the uh, the gold. We're about the stories. It's the journey on the open uh, ocean. So I'm up in the crow's nest having a look around, and I can see straight ahead of us there is a rock. I've been uh, to a rock. That's my report. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, so far, I don't see any sails around us, Captain. Okay, cool. The, 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 wind. the sea is the sea is open. Uh, yeah, looking uh, looking gonna, pretty I'm safe gonna, so far. I'm gonna head downstairs and cook you some dinner. Oh, that'd be to great. Make sure that you can like not die if we get attacked. <laughs> uh, let's see how we are on our heading. Yep, we're heading right towards that section. Cool.
So we need to find uh, some uh, sunken boats. And there's a treasure on one of the sunken boats that we need to retrieve onto our ship. Um, so we're heading in that direction now. Uh, hello, Josh, and hello, Harrison. Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you. We are sailing on the open ocean. And uh, we, can, we can even play a little jig for you to welcome you. Yeah, that's not very happy. Let's try another one. <laughs> nope, come on, new song. Oh, if it's your birthday, then kudos. So happy birthday, Josh and Harrison. It's probably not your birthday, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, nothing but silicone says you have a similar writing style to the author J.L. Bourne. Uh, he was in the Navy and wrote a fantastic zombie series. I I am familiar. Uh, we actually got connected a little bit back in the day on Facebook, um, and uh, I've heard that before. That we both have different, different but similar styles uh, in things. Hey, AJ. I, I thoroughly enjoyed your review of uh, Chapter 2 of Scout's Honor. I left a whole bunch of comments for you on your, your uh, YouTube channel. Um, I may have been doing that a little too late last night, but hey. That's okay. Uh, but it's a lot of fun. For those of you who uh, are not caught up on the series, so we have Scout's Honor is currently debuting uh, out there on all of our podcasts. Well, for the We're Alive Scout's Honor feed, uh, it's out there. We have not put it up. Um, chapter 2 is not on our normal feed. It's kind of a standalone one so that we can gather new listeners. Because it's a standalone story uh, about scouts surviving on an island in Catalina. Um, may maybe that's why we're doing Sea of Thieves. Because it's like an island out here in survival. <laughs> Is that the connection? I don't know. That, that can be the connection. Um, okay, I definitely didn't burn some some of the meat. <laughs> it's fine. It's oh. Fine. oh. It's not on fire. I, I, it's, it's all good. You can still eat it, it just won't give you anything. It gives you pity uh, points, I, mean, I, I think. I was just experimenting. Yeah. I was experimenting. It's fine. It's fine. Um, there's a lot of fun weirdness in this game, and one of them is cooking food, and if you cook it too long, you burn it, and if you leave it on way too long, then your boat catches on fire. Uh, AJ says, yes, thank you. We did see these. Thank you so much. It's like interviewing you. <laughs> yes, yeah, so it's, it's really fun. Um, AJ and his crew do a review show on We're Alive every week, and um, they have been uh, releasing them all on our release days, so those of you who listen early, can you have something to digest and, and listen to. So it's really fun to hear their take. And uh, as, as somebody who knows exactly where the series is going... Uh, it's fun to get their, like, theories about, oh, is, is this how it's going to be? Is it going to be this? Is it going to be this? And how right or wrong they might be. So if, if it wasn't for the fact that I know you plan everything out well in advance, so what you're saying is you've got a group of people you can get to listen to an episode and then give you ideas for the next episode. That'd be, I would say that that's true. <laughs> if I wasn't, like, if I this wasn't written, like, I don't know, two years ago. <laughs> Plus. Yes, exactly, yeah, I was on it. Um, I used to, back in the day when we were writing the original, well, I say we isn't I, uh, I was writing the original series, I used the Royal We a lot, um, the, uh, the series would release, uh, two chapters and then we would record and we, I would record and write another one, um, and when that happened, um, there was a little bit of like, oh, they didn't get this so I can adjust it a little bit here, mm, yeah. um, but, in terms of production, it was always harder because you had to record every other month, and uh, the 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 pace for that got a little crazy to keep up on doing that. And uh, it's really unforgiving if you want to like take vacations or do anything or have a life. So that everything got put on hold there. Um. Uh, nothing on Silicon asks, do you reply to the comments and questions on Kickstarter or is it an associate? Uh, most likely that is uh, going to be Gino uh, or Victoria who are responding to those. Um, I, um, I, I don't re reply personally to those just because, you know, that way we have at least uh, a uniform response and we don't comment twice. 
So that's sort of the uh, the idea. Um, but if you have questions about the Kickstarter, matter of fact, that's one of the reasons why we are doing this little live stream event uh, is we are drawing attention to the Kickstarter campaign, which is going on for our next series, which is um, We're Live Descendants Season 2 and 3. Well, we're currently kickstarting. So uh, we are we are looking for uh, funding for those seasons. And uh, yeah, because these, these, uh, the episodes of We're Alive take a lot to create. It's, uh, they can be very, uh, they're very detailed and there's a lot of pieces that go into them. And uh, a lot of work goes into it from our editing team to paying the actors. Um, it's just a lot of, a lot of stuff uh, goes into these. And, uh, you know, part of the reason why Scout's Honor took so long is just, you know, the meticulous details that, uh, that go into them. So that's why we do the Kickstarter campaign, so that we can continue to do more, uh, more stories. And uh, we also want to be able to close out the series, because uh, the series will ultimately come to a close uh, at the end of Season 2 of Descendants, because that's the end of the story. So... Uh-oh, did I hear something? I mean, I'm in the water with you. I'm a little concerned about how many ships there are around us. Um, okay, so all like these the, ships the are sunk. Ships, rather than... So there, that's okay, yeah. but I, I thought I heard a volcano going off. Um, so I'm gonna go check up above uh, yeah, real quick. Yeah, 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 uh, yeah, 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 definitely a volcano going off. <laughs> Come <Counted>. it. Um, <laughs> I'm not panicking. It's fine. Oh, we are close enough to get hit. Um, that might strike the boat. I'm heading back. Ow! Ow! Oh! And I also just got bitten by a shark. I'm, dear God. You're doing fine, Tom. You're doing fine. <laughs> uh, we so are, good. you know what, we are just outside of the reach, I think. Let's see. I mean, Let did, me go to the front of the boat. Did we pay for these special effects? Because they're pretty cool. It seems quite well timed. Yeah. Uh, and also, if anybody happens to donate while we're on the stream, we will celebrate you by letting you uh, pick a firework here, and we will celebrate in your honor. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna throw up one of those fireworks now. I'm gonna do a real cheap firework. We'll save the good ones for anybody who uh, who donates. And so we do things like this, and we'll celebrate you with a little cannon shot with a firework. Yay! Yay! Just like that. We may do more, but you know. I mean, I just I just want to confirm something, Captain. That does mean now all of the people around us might know where we are, right? Yes, if they're out Excellent. there. Okay, good, good. Yep. Uh, I don't they see any so indeed. far, thankfully. Oh, there's another volcano going off there. But I think we're safe. Uh, so we're supposed to, down there, in the... Um, we're supposed to find the Golden Star is the name of the boat. Now, if you look at a boat um, above the... Uh, well, our boat doesn't have our name up here. I don't know why. Um, but if you look right above this section of a boat, where the galley is on them, uh, they'll have the name right here, um, so you'll be able so it's to see. On my screen. Oh, it is. Yep. Oh, yeah. Lucky you. It didn't you online. Your censorship. <laughs> yes, maybe the censorship's up because we're uh, the name of our ship is uh, Eat Ship and Dive, so uh, it's maybe a play on words, but you know it's okay. Um, okay, a couple more okay. messages coming yeah. in. Uh, nothing but silicon says, well, time has come. I'm upping my pledge to associate producer. You better let, uh, re you better let me respectfully troll my buddy that it's 45 second message that's included. Lol. Sure. That'd be great. Uh, if you're going to be an associate producer, that would be really fun. Um, and so, uh, if, if you, if you, if you do that, uh, nothing but silicon, we will, we will light some uh, fireworks in your honor for the game. That'd be really fun. So let us know uh, when that happens. And if Gino, if you want to let me know too, um, who's monitoring our, uh, who is our moderator online right now, uh, we will do that. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, doing it right now. Woohoo! We have another associate producer coming in. Uh, Captain, Captain Bug says, uh, so we all hear, haha, the live and commenting, it's better than Facebook. <laughs> um, okay, so we need to find a key, Tom. Oh, by the way, one of our others is Mr. Toad says, Tom the Cabin Boy is the new RQ show. Aww. <laughs> That's fine by me. Tom the Cabin Boy. 
The Golden I Star. Say, when we get from... Oh, go ahead. When Sorry. Get to something else, when we get more, I was about to say, when we get more crew, then I can be promoted, right? That's, that's yeah, fun. yeah. Right now, you're cabin boy. If we get any donators who want to promote Tom to uh, to first mate, uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll, we we will get there. So, uh, so let's see here. We're looking for the Golden Star uh, ship. I'm looking at the red one at the moment. I don't think it's this. This is the Crimson. Yep, Crimson Revenge. Revenge. So the, the cool thing about these ships is they do have some trapped air, if you notice. Uh, right above the, uh, the the cabin, you can refill your air, and you don't have to come to the surface. Um, all right. Oh, I see. Oh. Queen's Envy. No, not this one. Wow. Okay. So, I see one that's not yellow, but kind of a bit yellow. Oh, I yeah, I see that. That's probably it. So we need to find a key inside this ship. Um, and they're hidden behind certain objects all over the boat. It has to be the ship because this is the last one. And boy, is it taking a long time to swim there. Probably going to get eaten by sharks by the yeah, time. Yeah, this, this is the Golden Star. All right, that's it. Oh, you know what? I like how they match the exterior with the name, the Golden Star. Oh, Mandelian Spit Silicone says, update the Kickstarter. I want fireworks. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, <laughs> I will, uh, w once I get to the surface, we are going to set off uh, a whole bunch of fireworks in your honor. Um, let's just find this. Are, are we going to have not... Are we going to have not brought enough fireworks? We're going to have to get more. Is that, well, is that I mean, if we have to buy more fireworks, we will buy more fireworks for sure. Um, uh, I found a bounty skull, but I don't think that's what we want. Um, I mean, if it's treasure, you can... The nice thing is if you go to the top and just let it go, we can pick it up. Oh, I got a bunch of burnt meat. Oh, cool. How, how there's burnt meat on the, in a ship that's under the ocean, I don't know. Um, I definitely didn't serve on this ship previously, Captain. It wasn't me. <laughs> is, that, is that why it sank? Is that why it sank? <laughs> I <accept> it. <laughs> uh, all right. Nope. Haven't found the key yet. So the 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 key is in little things like uh, it could be in a music box. It could be like there's a bunch of little objects to interact with on the boat. Um, oh, I see. I've just found a cage that I'm opening. Yeah, it's not in here though. Yeah. Oh, ooh, ancient fortune. We've, we got a we got a good relic here. Uh, anything that's ancient fortune stuff is uh, is well worth it. Uh, is there air on that level? Uh, no, I don't think so. But no. there's air right here in that little grate. Oh, here's here's a. Let's uh, see. Do we have a key? No, no key. We gotta check the cabin. Oh, did you grab the treasure? Oh, so if I'm standing oh. where, if I yeah, if I'm standing where the bubbles are, I'm not dying. Is that what you're saying? Yep. Yeah, you'll be fine there. Oh, okay. I'll, All right. I'll drop the relics. It goes up. Let's see here. Now I got the. Uh, I think I, I thought I searched the cabin, but yeah. Um, nope, not in there. Oh, this, this is gonna be a, a tricky one to find. Um. Thanks for hanging in there, nothing but silicone. We will get your fireworks in a, in momentarily. I prom promise. Well, that didn't work out. Uh. Nothing yet down there. Oh, I found, I found a crate. Oh, I found the key. <gasps> oh, yay! That's the key. The key. It was in a crate on the bottom floor. Oh, perfect. Okay, I'll meet you back on the ship so we can celebrate our okay. our, our our new backer. Um, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Hopefully, no one has pirated our boat. No, nope, we're still good. I mean, if they have, there isn't much treasure on board. Okay, what is that? Okay, that's a rock. Uh, I don't see any ships on the horizon. Okay, cool. All right, so how do, how, do I, how do I give you the key? Oh, you can just put it down on the on the ship. We're gonna have to use it in a second. Uh, so just there you go. Um, all right, so let's open our Athena Fortune fireworks. All right, let's get a really good one here. Um, Masked Stranger. You know what? That might be fitting. Let's do the Masked Stranger here. Uh, here we go. Not just a backer. She's a producer. <laughs> Boom. Okay. okay, that's pretty impressive. 
There's one. All right, let's see here. Uh, let's do another one. I might go a little. I might go a little uh, firework crazy because uh, I mean, uh, associate producer. I mean, these are a little more impressive at night. I will say. So I'll fire off another one now. But I might save a couple more. Ooh, little skull. Uh, I might save a couple for uh, for night. So, uh, I mean, you could also sail into a storm or something, right? That would. That might work. Yeah. Oh, unicorn. Here we go. We'll do. We'll do one last unicorn, and then I'll save the rest for uh, for for nighttime. So they're a little bit more easier to see. I mean, who sets off fireworks during the day? Pyros. Ta-da! Yay! Well, thank you, nothing but silicon. We'll do it. We'll. Where, where's our dance? Tom, do you know how to dance? Uh, <laughs> not well. <laughs> Let's find a button. Uh, <laughs> do, 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 I can do, tell do, you do. that I need help. <laughs> um, I only know uh, it's the it. down arrow I'll on. Next time. Hang on, I'm, I'm telling you, not looking up the controls right now. I'm just gonna clap um, while I might. wait. Okay, stow weapons. No, we don't want that. Uh, uh, quest, no. Who needs to Tom dance? Tim, not helping. Tom needs to dance. I do. <laughs> I can't work it out. I can... Oh, gosh. Okay, keep on it. This is the problem, is I'm playing on a PC. Which, Shay. by the way, thank you very much for, for agreeing to play with me on a PC. Shay. On an Xbox. <laughs> um, okay, primary... Brian says, uh, listen to the first three episodes of Scout's Honor yesterday, and it's another masterpiece. Loved it. Aw, thanks, Brian. Harrison you says, you better dance. Harrison was here for our last live stream, so good to see you, Harrison. Uh, we played uh, a bunch of our little online games. It was cool. Harrison might have made a rivalry with me. Uh, I mean, I could help you with that. Uh, you still can't figure it out? No, not yet. I'll, 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 I'll work on it. If anyone in chat knows the keyboard shortcut in, uh, on the LPC, let me know. <laughs> well, while you figure that out, I'm going to go down there and get the fortune uh, from the... Is that the ship we need to do? That might be. Let's see. I think that might be the ship. So we have to go into the ship and grab uh, a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, I grabbed the bits that we'd floated to the uh, sur uh, surface. Oh, I think I might have found it. Hang on. Is this... Ah -ha -ha! I can cheer and dance. Okay, I I'm good. I don't get need to get shot. Okay. Um, well, I will I will help dance with you uh, in a moment. But, uh, oh yeah, you're going to the right ship. So this ship here is the one that has the, uh, the locked cabin that we need the key for. Oh, uh, I see, yeah. Yeah, so we can't get in that door without the key. Uh, nothing but silicon says, yeah, Scout's Honor is really good. Never been to Catalina, but I uh, always wanted to go. Uh, honestly, it, I got to go a couple times, uh, for this production, uh, and it was so much fun. Um, and, um, I will be honest, we are thinking about, if we can, doing an event on the island, um, one day. That'd be really, really fun. Uh, like having a, a, a real camp we're alive. Uh, where people come can come out and stay on the island and stuff, and um, we'll we'll get there eventually. Um, so Tom, inside the cabin, there's a whole bunch of treasure if you wanna just grab it and oh, toss I, it I to the surface. Out already. Oh, oh, okay. perfect. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's really really fun. The the camp is when they say the camp is magical, it really is. Uh, and also the people there are really great. Like the they the the Boy Scout Association, the people who run the camp, who like let me do a whole bunch of on-site uh, recordings and research on the island. Um, there's a video back from uh, 2017 about when we originally went to the island to do our research, and um, it uh, we got to we we actually came in in Avalon uh, on the the main uh, Catalina cruiser. And ended up taking a jeep across the island to do research, and it was really a lot of fun. Um, and also, how we were able to learn so much about the the island and all the little details there. Because 
as the story progresses, and even like when you get to two harbors and such, uh, a lot of those things are um, uh, very accurate to what the island is. Uh, I'm up here in the Pacific Northwest, so I finally have a reason to go. Yeah, it's it's really uh, it's really a lot of fun, um, and the island it's very quiet there. It's very um, uh, it's hard to describe. Um, but when you go, it's, it's, I, I, it's funny, back in the day, Catalina used to be the hot spot where all the celebrities used to go, um, and then, uh, when Natalie would, um, then it kind of dissipated and, and died a little, sadly. Um, but I, it's, it's such an amazing place, um, and, uh, I would love, I'd love to take a whole bunch of fans there and, uh, hang out on the island and... You know, have a campfire and, you know, make it kid-friendly and it'd be a lot of fun. So, just because I'm a bit new to this, we, put, we got the gem and you put it in that thing and that's meant the ghost is telling us we're doing a job and we should do more things, right? Yes, so there are three gems we have to capture. We got one of them and they're going to get progressively uh. harder in these missions as we go. The third one is going to be really hard. Um, we're... Did you go back in the water? Uh, no, I'm, I'm currently uh, looking out from the, the, the crow's nest, making sure there's no other pirates around. Ah, okay. Well, we, we uh, owe a dance. Excellent. So I'll, I'll, I'll start the jib. Another basilicon says, oh, I like uh, places that are a bit more quiet. Sense. Yeah, it's really it's really nice there, and uh, the the it's not too far from California, but it's far enough to where like you get to see the stars at night, and it's it's really really fun. Ta-da! Well, thank you so much, uh, our new associate producer, um, who has brought us up to we are now at sixty one thousand with uh, seven hundred and eleven backers. Oh, amazing. Yay! Thank you so much. Uh, we really, really appreciate it. Um, I'm actually... Uh, I don't know if I've told Gino this, but one of our stretch goals um, was that uh, if we hit a certain level, that I was going to act out a um, scene or uh, uh, one of the chapters of We're Alive. And I'm actually uh, thinking about doing that for our last stream the day before the Kickstarter ends. Um, as sort of like a, um, you know, those telethons where they just, you know, it's, you just kind of keep on going. Um, I wonder, I might, I might do that to try and rally us at the last day. Um, that'd be fun. That so, seems like a brilliant idea. Yeah. So who knows? Maybe I'll do the, start, just start doing the entire series and go until we've hit our goal. Um, that might be a little crazy. And I'll probably be dead by the end of it. But you know what? It'll be fun. Um, okay, the Veil Stone wasn't in the chest on the north of Kraken's Fall. Should have known, should have known. Ancients bury the stones deep, come find me. Um, okay, so Suds wants us to find him on Kraken's Fall. Uh, all right, cool. We can, Kraken's we, Fall. We can do that. that. All right, so uh, Kraken's Fall. I think that Kraken's Fall is... There we go. To our west. So, uh, okay. all right. So go ahead and, uh, actually, I'll, I'll just turn the boat. All right. That's completely behind us. Do you want me to put some sails out? Uh, wait till we go 180. Otherwise, we'll go right into that, um, oh, shipwreck. Point, yep. All right. And drop sail. I think it's, is Kraken's Fall this one little island over here? What, what did, what did we hit? We're hitting something. I don't know what we hit, but we hit something in the water. Uh, I will, I will check to make sure that we're not leaking. We're good. There yeah, I think leaks. we're okay. Is this island not on the map? Am I? Oh no! no oh, this is Fetcher's Rest. We have to go around it. Okay. Uh, yeah. So I'm looking at the map now, and if we go around Fetcher's Rest and then head directly in every tree, we west. We're good. Cool. Uh, Harrison says, I don't have money with an unhappy cry face. That's okay. Just listening to the show, joining us on the live stream, 
sharing the the your love of the infection as weird as that, as that sounds uh is is all helpful to us so we we appreciate it uh mr toad says does tom have an update on the ghost boy who lives in his garden oh that sounds like a loaded Wait, one that does sound like a loaded one do you have an update <laughs> on the ghost boy who lives in his garden do you have a ghost boy that lives in your uh, garden tom i i had a ghost that was haunting my toothbrush um, and so I don't know if it's that that they're related to, <laughs> but basically I, uh, weirdly, inter like, intermittently, for no apparent reason, my electric toothbrush would just turn on. Um, oh. And it got to the point I was getting an EMF reader out to try and, like, deter determine whether there was a ghost haunting my toothbrush. Which, if you know anything about EMF readings, by the way, it totally was just picking up the fact that the toothbrush was electric. But anyway. <laughs> Nothing but silicon says, I'm excited for the dice, cards, and t-shirt. Wish I would have picked some up during the lockdown Kickstarter. Yes, that's the the cool thing about the, the Kickstarter campaigns is we get these little exclusive merch things. Um, but I'm really excited about the cards. Uh, in fact, uh, I wonder if I could... Ch uh, are we... You know what? Let me turn slightly here to Dead West, and I'll let Tom take the boat for two seconds. Uh, there we go. Oh, God, I'm going to stay. Okay, it's, can't go wrong. All right, so uh, you should be good there. Um, so let me let me get them. I have the proofs that we have uh, for all the cards and how they'll look, uh, and they look really cool. Um, so I don't know if you can see my on my little tiny screen down there. Um, all the uh, these are the the actual cards. Uh, these are the proofs to see what they look like with the kings and queens. And there's a there's a little inside joke on the Joker, um, which is really fun. Uh, so there's, uh, they turned out really nice. Um, so these, these are, uh, gonna look pretty impressive when they're all, when they're all said and done. So, yeah. Ta-da! And then they have the, the card backs, and they got their little, the cool little containers that they're gonna go into. Um, I am a big, I'm a big fan of, uh, of card games. Uh, I put them in... Just about every iteration of We're Alive. I didn't put them in Scout's Honor. Um, part of me regrets that a little bit, but oh well. The idea being that, uh, you know, cards are infinite. You can, uh, as, with a deck of cards, you can occupy your brain practically forever. Um, okay, Tom, we're going to go to the north side of the island. So as you're approaching the island, you're going to go to your right side. Um, that's starboard, for anybody who knows nautical terms. Port is left, starboard is right, uh, based on how you're looking at the ship. Um, the only reason uh, uh, that you're turning left. You want to go the other way? I, I, I am turning left. I was going to oh. Oh, a world event just appeared. Did you hear that little low drone? I, I did, yeah. It's uh, a good thing, right? Low drones mean happiness? They, well, it means that a, a skull appeared in the sky, which is a, an event for one of the um, the forts, which uh, we won't be doing, because that's a little it's a little complicated. All right, so very doing well, doing well. I'm just seeing if there's any other... There's no Reapers on the map. Reapers are um, boats that are specifically out to sink other boats, and they mark themselves accordingly. Um, so you want to go right, if you can. Right, roger that. I was going to say, I've just seen in chat that I, I thought it's Mr. Toad, might be who I think it is. He is he is one of the creators on the network from the show Sleep. So there you go. That's why he knows about my garden ghost, probably. <laughs> Uh, a couple of new things here. Let's see here. Harrison said, like they did in lockdown. Yes, Tien Len um, is a really fun game that I like playing with cards because uh, you can get really bad cards, but if you know how to play them, you can still win. Um, did the audio CDs of the story survival on Amazon come in a case like lockdown did? Um, yes, similar. Um, I would say check because they also sell MP3 CDs which um, aren't really helpful for most people, uh, but they do come in a case. I think, I don't have any of those samples around here. Uh, I might, but it's, I do have one, but it's behind the screen of the game I'm playing and I'd have to take a break to get it. But I can, I can maybe show you that. But uh, those are available through Blackstone. Um, and 
yeah, uh, they're pretty cool. I like having the CD versions. It's 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 nice to fall back on. Um, and also for those listeners who may not have you know devices, we have a lot of listeners who are um, watching and listening on uh, you know cars and things, and that sometimes they can't connect phones. Catch you up, Captain. I'm just setting the ship up for a speedy getaway if we need it. Oh, okay, got it. I already see suds. It's interesting. Uh, we 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 had this mission here in our test yesterday, so it actually is very beneficial that uh, we know exactly where suds is now. All right, so I talked to suds. I got bit by a snake. I'm poisoned. Um, so you, is there a way for you to survive? Actually, you so know what? Suck out the poison option. So I'm going to die by snake. So I'm going to let the snake kill me. Okay. Uh, and the reason why is because uh, if you, the way you die in the game, um, you end up spawning in the the ship of the damned. Oh, is it not? Am I still not? Wow, I'm not dying very fast. Um, and then you can come back with a certain light. Oh yeah, I think I need to go to another. Here, Tom, I have a present for you. Hold this. Uh, Roger that. What, what are we holding? It uh, seems to be a gunpowder barrel, Captain. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> Tom! Don't go to your garden, Tom! Don't go to your garden! Oh, no! Oh, no! And there he goes. Uh, oh, I got, a, I got an achievement for that in $1,500. <laughs> <laughs> wow! There, it's, uh, that's, I mean, that's the ghost ship is I've definitely not been here before multiple times yesterday. It's fine. So now you can go and, uh, oh, ooh, no more snakes. Oh, thanks for biting me. Come again. Come on. Uh, if I stay here, do you turn up as well? Uh, I will turn up there. Event I mean, if these snakes actually kill oh, me. Uh, I'm, I'm slowly getting there. I'm slowly getting poisoned. Uh, sliver of life, sliver of life, and there I go. Yay! Oh, the snake bit me as I was dying again. He's now eating my corpse. Alright, here we go. So Tom is on the ship of the damned. Fairy of the damned, excuse me. Um, but And depending on how you die, you can get different colors for your lamps. See, I have a blue one now. And then uh, you come over here and you go out the door. Um, that's how they uh, they get you to have like a delay when you die. So if we're playing the game and we get boarded or we die, um, our ship can be attacked while we're on the ferry and uh, can easily sink. But now that I have the blue flames, I can go around to all of the little lanterns and I can turn them blue. Oh, so we have oh, a little cool. a little. Uh, more blue shit now. Yeah, blue. Uh, some mood lighting in down here. Okay, Suds gave us a mission. What is our mission now? Okay. Uh, I like the way you can you can viciously point your book at people. Be like, read that book. Yeah, like look here. Um. Okay, keep going, man. It's taking a long time. Oh, all right. Oh boy, we got to go back into the ashen land where the volcanoes are. The jewel from the okay. first stories. It longs to see the sky. Okay. We need to figure out which island that is. So... Uh, no, so we have to look at the map and work out what it looks like. I'm ready. Yep, okay, so that... If might... I stand here and hold the book. Yep, found it. Right here, Fetcher's Rest. So it's due east. Uh, do you want to take us due east? Due east, remember that, Captain? Uh, I will clear out our markers. Uh, we want to be very careful because uh, when we go close to an island, it's, this is one of those ones you definitely want to point away and leave someone on the boat because if the boats, if the island starts erupting, you want someone to, to beat to be feet to out of there, yeah. Because uh, one or two direct hits with a volcano and you are done. <laughs> Heron uh, said... We are... We are oh, I was just saying, Harrison says, hold this, it explodes. They did. They, uh, they, we are set they, due east, Captain. Oh, perfect. If you keep heading dead straight ahead, that'll be, uh, we'll put us right to where we need to go. 
Uh, there's, there's another volcano going off over there. Uh, let me check sails. Can they go any lower? Let's see. Nope, that's full. And, yeah, I think we're at 100% for, for wind. Oh, no, now we are. I was about to say, I did try and get it. There we go, cool. Alright. I was about to say, my, 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 my dad will be upset with me for not being good with my port and starboard, because he did originally, when I was younger, teach me to sail. Oh! And nowadays, I'm like, barely knowing my left and right. I, I was fortunate enough to have access to be able to sail on the yacht when I was younger. It was very fun. I watch uh, Below Deck, so by now I'm an expert. <laughs> uh, I'm just organizing our, our little booty down here on the on the on the deck, uh, nice. so that we can turn it all in. Uh, it hasn't turned to night yet because I was going to launch some more fireworks in uh, nothing but silicone's honor, but um, we have not uh, not been able to do that yet. So, another uh, Basilicon, uh, who are you going to troll on your message? Curious. I want to hear the story now. Uh, okay. which, which beach do you want on this island? Uh, I think it's going to come up real close here. Let's start raising sails. So, this is one of the ones you don't want to uh, drop anchor because... By the time you got your anchor up, uh, your boat may be sunk. Roger that. Oh, is that... Okay, that's another island. All right. Um, okay, so this is... This is good. All right, I know my bearing. I have to get a marker on the island. It's very easy to get turned around in this game, especially when you're searching for treasure. Um, so here we go. To the island. Uh, I'll try and get the boat a little bit close without crashing it, and then turning around, that's my plan, and be ready to, you know, bail, basically, or dodge rocks, I should say. Oh, um, there is an earthquake happening on the island, so, um, 180 the boat and be ready to leave, um, but... I totally haven't hit a rock. Don't, just don't look behind you, that's all I'm saying. Okay, if it starts, uh, we got rumbling on the island. If it starts to smoke, that's when we're in trouble. Yeah, I'm not below decks fixing a hole. It's fine. Um, let me know if, <laughs> if you want me to run. I think we're good. I think it would be... Uh, I got a little bit of rumble, but I'm not seeing the smoke billowing yet. Okay. I'm definitely not stuck with the ship going in circles. It's fine. Alright, we're good. We're good. Nothing okay. went wrong. It's all fine. Alright, so... Alright, there's a skeleton and then a mass of the green. I think it's over here somewhere. Let's see. Nope, can't dig there. Oh, this is going to be real tricky. Because um, I don't really have a lot of landmarkers here either, because everything's going off around me. Oh, great. And now I got skeletons. Alright. Oh. The undead of the island, which are infected, are not uh, dead, if anybody's wondering. There seems to be geysers all around you. Yeah, it, uh, the island is very, very, very volcanic. Oh, buddy. Oh, uh, another Basilicon says, uh, um, oh, I have a friend that streams on Twitch that loves We're Alive. I turned him on the show. Uh, now I just need to think of something clever. I'll probably want to thank an uh, old co-worker that introduced me to the show as well. Oh, that's great. We love we love when people share their love for the show. It can be a really great experience to have someone else listen with you. That's why uh, I think AJ has a lot of fun with it uh, and his team. All right. I mean, it's close... I'd like to say I'm really good at this game and an expert, but when it comes to this stuff, it gets it gets tricky fast. Uh, if anybody wants to help me out here, unfortunately, you don't see where the treasure sticks out. Okay, so there's that little glowy strip there. I think that's the glowy strip. 
Which makes me think it would be here, but no. Um, oh, I can... Oh, I forgot I can zoom in. Okay, so... There is a patch of grass and then a little, like, ridge. Is this that ridge there? No. I swear I know what I'm doing. I was okay. going to say, if, let me know when you want me to start shot at gunning, like, a spade over there with myself. I am a little conscious of the fact that, yeah, if a volcano kicks off, we're in trouble. So. I'm just, right now, almost digging in random spots until I, uh... It's... This is sad. It's very sad. Uh, I'm holding up everything until I find this. How, how, how did you zoom in on the map? Uh, you push... Uh, I mean, I push in my right stick. Oh, with different buttons. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, okay, let me, let me double check and make sure that there's a skeleton over here. So I think I think you need to be very near the yeah. where the ship is at the edge. Like, yeah, so, so go where to the. So I think you're too far north. All right, let's see. Oh come on! Too far north. Yeah. Well, I was just checking on the the skeleton to make sure that was there. So it's almost like the tail of the skeleton here. Because you need to like, okay, so right here. And then I just start walking towards the boat. It's almost near where these geysers are. Oh, shoot. Um. Okay. I swear it should be here. Oh, there I go again. You know that if I head over there, I'm just going to have beginner's luck and just accidentally take it up on second. You know what? At this point, I'd say it'd be worth it. Go for it. Roger that. I, I will... I will... Uh, okay. Uh, give me a minute, because I'm totally not picking the that might set part of the ship. Ah, yeah, yeah, I'll... I'll... Give me a minute. Okay. I'll okay. Right oh, boy. I'm flying in the air again. Oh. I think what we've discovered is me and you are not great at orienteering. Yeah, I mean, I'm better on other islands. This one's just really hard because the ground's constantly changing. Uh, is it, um, it can't be behind this rock, is it? No, we can't dig uh, there. There's a weird statue in the water between us and the ship that just hurt me. Oh, that's a that's a dead mermaid. Um, you if you uh, spend enough time killing it, which is not easy to do. Presume you get a treasure or something. Yeah. I swear I have dug so many holes now. The thing I'm worried about is if I do get there and find it really quick, it's gonna it's gonna mean that I'm gonna have to do this again in the future. Uh possibly. Uh there's 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 a skeleton. Oh god. Oh, hey. I mean, just by random luck, I would have been able to find it by now. Well, there we go. Hello. Hello. Okay. So, there are holes everywhere. <laughs> okay. So, the ship's there. I don't, yeah, you're right. These geysers are definitely not helping the situation, right? No. No. Okay. So, there is a clear path. This is that clear path right here. So that's the clear path. And then there's a little bit of a of a little walkway between stuff. I got a good view from the air. Oh, I think I'm gonna die. Uh can you revive me? Uh, uh don't do that. If you come uh, close you can revive me. Do that? Uh just come up to me and hit a button. Oh I see, yeah. Am I gonna live? Am I gonna live? Am I gonna live? Am I gonna live? Oh yeah. Probably gonna die very quickly without any food, so I'm gonna go try and hit a barrel. Hold on. Yeah, I didn't bring the cooked food with me, that was a mistake. Uh it's okay, I got a, I got a, found a couple things. Uh I've got a coconut if that helps you. Oh. 
Okay. There is this path in between. Oh, my brother would not be. My brother and I play this game. He he would be. <laughs> I see the finding. Uh, sometimes yes, and then sometimes stuff like this happens, and he can't find it either. Okay, so uh, there's pirates, uh, pirate, pirate uh, things. Skele at skeletons or real pirates? Uh, skeletons. Okay. Those aren't as scary. Uh, I killed one. There was two that were coming at you. I think you got them. Uh, oh, it's, okay. It stops the steam for the time being, which is good. Oh my gosh. Suds. Alright, so I think that this green thing here is the green thing in the map. This is so sad. Yeah, so that's the green thing in the map. This is the green thing. But I'm stood on maybe. It's like so a... I need to be at the bottom edge of it. About here somewhere. It's my guess. Still not. Uh, Abby Studios says, I just want to say I had the privilege to listen to y'all. Uh, show granted that I'm very late to the party. I started listening to the podcast when I was in high school. Aw. That's okay. The party's always going. There's, there's no late to the party. It's still going. We have... Fifteen years. Tom, this is crazy. I'm beginning to think that I it's found some grubs. It's not even I feel like it's not even here. This is definitely the island. This is definitely the Oh! Oh, what was that oh. Nice? oh! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! This is the this is like a Yay! We got ancient skeleton Bye. coins. Those are like real world currency. It's a very right, random so event. Worth coming here, is what you're saying. Y yes. So, if anything, we got nice random coins. Okay, so let's use that luck. Um, as I dig into the air. Did you say you were concerned this is not the correct island? I'm concerned that we got a glitch that doesn't actually have a have it spawning here. Right, I'm gonna go over here where it's safe for a moment, and I'm gonna I'm gonna look at the map again. Um, there is another risky situation that we can try. And that is if we both die. Well, how does that help? Uh, it resets the island. Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm spotting this thing. That maybe we're in the wrong place. Wait one, wait one. Uh, I'm gonna go back and get some food uh, then. Uh... It might be where I am now. If you get it, I'll be so happy. I think we touched slightly. No pressure, but if you do get it, you you become first mate. I become first mate, right, right, right? So, give me a minute. Oh god, don't die of being knocked around, right? So, I think we have the alignment slightly wrong. Uh, give me a minute. It's, it's gone a bit mental. Uh-oh. Right? Uh-oh. Tom, I'm stuck in a rock. Oh, don't be dead. Do I need someone to rescue you? Or are you good? Um, are you good? No. No, I'm not okay. Uh, um, I... I, uh, I could shoot you? I need you to potentially kill me. Um, I have, okay. do, you have, do you have blunder bombs? I have something here that looks like a maybe a bomb. Is this oh. thing a bomb? Let's try it. Yes. Do you have any more? Take. Yep. Do you have any more? Uh, I've got this thing as well. Die, die, die. Okay, okay. here we go. Yay! Yay! Yeah, I got stuck on a rock. Sorry, sorry. Back to, back to my plan of... Right. Where's the map gone? Because getting stuck on a rock is so I mean, great for a stream. <laughs> that's it. This is a thrilling stream. We're stuck digging holes on an island, being unable to find the loot. Right, okay. I think I'm... I think I might be near...
nearly there. I am just glad that the island. Ha I mean, I sh maybe I shouldn't say that the, uh, the. I'm glad the island hasn't erupted yet. I don't. Maybe I shouldn't say that. I was about to say, it would be it more exciting, right? Well. Okay, so shoot higher now. Oh no, no, what? Tom, I'm in the spot again. <laughs> So, do I go back to the ship and shoot it with a cannon? Is that? Um, I mean. Does a blunderbuss hurt you? No. Oh, this is. This uh, is. This. I. <laughs> is the chest down there? Uh, at this point, maybe. <laughs> Twenty lots of grubs up here. Uh, right, I'm gonna head back to the ship, and I'm gonna uh, shoot you with something, like a cannon. I don't know if that works. Uh, you need to get blunder bombs and throw them at me. This is okay. pathetic. Oh, I can't even kill myself. Uh, well, Harrison says it'd be cool if you could put we're alive on the side of a ship. I agree. Also, be really cool if I didn't get stuck on a rock. Uh, yep, I got no throwable items. I don't want to eat because if I eat, then I'm going to refill my health, and I don't Be want it. I'm with you. Yeah. A blunt bomb to anything that will do damage to you. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, okay, so look, hang on. I am I am not going to attempt to shoot out of the cannon again on this island because apparently this is like a a pocket that uh, will just suck you up. It's a pocket dimension that you get trapped in. Lance was wondering, uh, what this game? What is this game? This is Sea of Thieves. This is uh, a pirate game. Yeah, you may have to just swim over. Okay, there I am. Here we go. Yes. Kill me. Yay! One more. I'm, this is the you're the best captain ever, by the way. Just like, encouraging me to to murder you. <laughs> Harrison says, "How do you get stuck twice? It's you know what." It, it's it's like a like at that point it was like a gutter for a bowling ball. It just magnetized me over there. Um, There's part of me that wants to try the cannon, but I also don't want to try. The no, cannon. I don't. That, it's at this point we we'd be pushing our luck a lot more. So that was that. Um, can I can I make a suggestion when you come back on the ship? Have a look at the map of the island on the ship. Yep. And just double check that you're happy that this is the right island. And then maybe between us we can orienteer it. Yep. Okay, so alright. I'm gonna bring I'm gonna bring the ship real close to the island. So that I can get yeah, up in the no, map. It looks like the right Yeah. That's a good idea. That's a good shout. I just realized there's a shoreline here. That it shouldn't be on that shoreline though. Well, no, because the, the map shows the location. It doesn't seem to be there, right? Yeah, no. Whoops. Uh, there's some gold purses up here, or gold pouches that I'm stealing. Oh, that's good. Okay. So now... Turning the boat... Uh, you need to be over here, I think. You know where you got stuck? Uh, let's just see what happens when I get up here. I don't, I don't know if I can get that close uh, to the island. So, so, hello. So basically, you see over here we've got the pointy bit and the rock that you got stuck on. Yep. So to your right. Um, I feel like I, what I was trying to do with the map is take a line off that point of the island towards the island and follow that line. Hopefully that'll make sense when you see the map in a minute. Yes. Okay, there's a there's this little rock point there. So I think it's more where I am now. Um, is that? It yeah, might be it seems like that should be the right spot. I'll try and get um, a little bit closer, but it seems like it's somewhere in there. Yeah, and there's kind of a rock surface here that makes me think I can't dig until I get slightly further forward. Yeah, keep digging. Give it, a, give it a go. Roger, roger. I'm gonna try and get closer. This island 
it's definitely a violent island that likes to kill people. Yeah, this is an, uh, this is this is not a, a fun island. And uh, I think also because of the way that this island works and where it buried this thing that we may have gotten a glitch. There's a chance for right, that. Right, right. I say we give it another we five do... minutes. Yeah. All right, so I'm coming up here in the crow's nest now. I am as close as I possibly can without getting completely stuck oh, with the boat. Wait, 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 <gasps> wait, wait, wait. You did it. First mate, Tom. <laughs> it was in this corner. Oh. It was just above where you kept getting stuck. Oh, yay. Well, at least you have it. Uh, if you want to jump into I the have... water, I will get I you. Will. I will avoid. Okay, I shall... Oh. Oh, thanks. Uh, you can open this chest, apparently. I yes. So. We want to do, do that. that and take out the, the gem. Oh, okay. Uh, I will do that now, then. First mate, Tom. Good job. You want the, you want the, you want the gem. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shoot. Sorry. Um, there is a pirate ship in the... Uh. It is... Uh, I think we need to go after it. Now, this is going to okay, get Roger. really challenging. This is a, um... Uh, let's see here. Is this, is this, is this, is this where the run ends and we have to restart? Because we're about to die dramatically to... Um, well, this is, it's a, um, it's a galleon. And this is going to be hard. Oh, we can... We can get... Oh. Well, we're gonna get attacked by a ship anyway. That's just that's the sound of it. So, uh, come down here. Uh, okay, come in, come in. Oh god, yeah, I see it. Uh, do you want me to steer or shoot? Uh, steer. steer. I can shoot. Roger. You shoot, I'll steer. Uh, you want me to try and avoid ramming them, but stay in a position where they can't shoot us, right? Yes. Right there is perfect. Roger. Going left, I'm gonna try and stick with them. Yeah, no, good, good. We're in good shape. Oh, look at the island blowing up behind us. We got it right at the right time. <laughs> so, careful not to go too close to the island because. Oh, they just got hit. Oh, boy, they just got hit. Uh, oh, we're, we're yeah, too close to the that. island. Pull away from the island. I'm pulling away, pulling away. Uh, that one may hit us. Oh. We appear to be on fire or something. Yep, we're on fire. And the mast just collapsed. That's not a good sign. Uh, how do we deal with the mast having collapsed? Um, yes. So you have to raise the sails um, with one of the director things back there. I think we killed the... I see it, I see it. We killed the skelly ship. The skelly ship is sinking. Uh, but we are still in range of the, uh, of the island. Okay, now don't do anything yet. I have to repair the mast. Good job, first mate Tom. Okay, we you can it. you We're can now it. lower the uh, sails slightly, but turn us right to get out of the uh, um, out of the kill zone of the thing. You can notice if you're too close because it rains ash from the sky. Oh uh, yeah, I see. So now we're clear. Okay, we have a hole down here. Uh, currently, I'm just setting course with the wind to get us a bit further away from the island, and then we can work out where we're going after that. Yeah, so we want to go back to that where we sank that little ship once the uh, once the island has stopped erupting, because there's a whole bunch of oh, treasure right, there now. Uh, so hang her right. We I think we're safe to go back. Turn us around again, now. Roger. Uh, yeah, it's still blowing up. And our next mission that we have is over there in that tornado. Which we will have lots of times to use our our combat skills. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna raise the sails a little bit. Just yeah, to I would actually raise them all the, the way, and you, we can just project. chill here for a minute while it uh, while it resets. Seems like an absolutely opportune moment to cook some more meat. That'd be perfect. Uh, Nejek Umar says, First Mate Tom has been a lifesaver. No kidding. No kidding. 
Thank you very much. I was almost better ready to give up on that island. And honestly, if it would have erupted while we were on there, I don't know. I don't know if I would have come back. I think we timed it right. I mean, we clearly paid the developers to erupt an island dramatically just at the right moment during a combat. Oh, yeah. And it, it hit their boat, too, which was great. <laughs> Where uh, was this uh, player galleon you saw? Was I imagine? Uh, it's, it's not a player uh, galleon. It's actually a, a skelly galleon back there. It's, it's oh, okay. right behind us. It's a three-mast one. So that was a sloop that we went up against now. Not too difficult. Yep. I can sink so, them fairly well. But that one has, like, three cannons on it. Oh, uh, I see the one you're talking about, yeah, in the distance. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That, one's a, that one's a little much for us. But we'll have some opportunities here once this thing stops erupting. I'm thinking, jeez, this thing's been erupting for a while. Pretty cool shot. I really with, like with the waves. Skull. I know this is... This is going to be a really stupid thing to say, but I like the fact that the waves are really big, so it means that you have to go up high to see over them to see stuff on the horizon. Yeah, and I mean, That's a really nice touch. Uh, like I'm, I'm playing on my projection screen right now, which is uh, 140 inches, and you can get seasick nice. if you're not like <laughs> careful, because it is it rocks and rolls. So, what's the plan? We loot the loot that we just sunk, mm -hmm. and then we go after the three masts. Uh, what's that? A galleon. Well, there's a tornado by in the distance over here on the left. That's our that's our mission. Oh, I see. And there will be right. some boats there. They're just they're ghosts. So we'll have plenty of uh, okay. opportunities for that. Action. Yep. Uh, and we have to. Like the island has stopped erupting. Yep. And we have to uh, blow up a um, couple forts on islands too. Okay. And, and then we'll get our third gem, and that'll make the the person we're doing local happy, right? Oh yeah, and we're if we get the third gem, we'll also get a massive amount of uh, of money when we turn in the loot if we make it back to the place in time. Uh, not in time, oh, but nice. without getting killed or abducted by other which pirates. Just, which is Wait, oh oh, we got another uh, world stop, event. Stop 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 the ship! Stop the ship! We're near the thing as well. Well, we now have a oh, new. We have a new uh, thing. We have a megalodon need... attacking us. How do we deal with that? Uh, we shoot it with cannonballs. Roger that. Uh, okay, okay, this is a pink one. It's to the left. Um, yeah. So get your cannonballs in there, and you can shoot it with your pistol too. Okay, where is it? Uh, it's it's on our our backside here. Your side, your side, yeah. Got it once. I'll get my blunderbuss out. Uh, blunderbuss, you may want to switch to your uh, pistol or the uh, sniper. Because the oh, blunderbuss is going to be too far off. Am I even hitting it at all? <laughs> Harrison says, you shoot it, that's how you deal with it. He shoots it. Oh, I hit it. I hit it with my pistol. Okay. Yeah, you can see it react. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. On my end, I can hear triumphant little, uh... Are we still cooking stuff down there? Um... I'm not setting fire to the, ca the cabin. I hear f fire. I hear no, fire. We're not, we're not on fire. We're not on fire. It's fine. <laughs> the barrels are not filled with burnt food. It's not a problem. <laughs> Got it. Okay, got it th three times there. It's it's actually the cannons are hard to use in this game because you know you rock and roll and you have to like lead your target and and see where it's going. And I'm surprised. I mean, I might be dooming us a little bit, but I'm surprised this megalodon has not charged the ship. I mean, clearly we're just scaring off with our superior skills. It's getting weaker. Oh, well, I fell in the water. I fell in the water. That's probably not a good thing to be. All right, he's coming around again. Uh, uh, we're, our little treasure from that ship is going to sink fairly soon. So once we sh shoot this two, thing, yeah, harping. We'll harp. We'll go back to the ship, and then um, 
we were very close to it. Just yeah, there, the yay! Okay. Got the Megalodon. Alright, so now... Oh, the island is erupting again. But is it the one that's I closest? I think it's different islands. It's oh, you're different. right. Oh, no! Uh, okay. So, where was the treasure? I right like we right there. Right in front of us, I think. Um, I can't you might have to get up in the mast to see it, but I'm pretty sure it's right over here. But it also might have sank. I, was just, I don't see. It. Oh no! Yeah, straight ahead, straight ahead to the right slightly. Uh, stop now. We're about right, I think. Maybe. Oh, that's not our treasure. Or is, is it? There's be something floating in the water. It was all right. Here, look. Oh. Oh yeah, the treasure's sinking. Stand by. I'm, I'm swimming. I'm swimming. I grabbed a couple of this. Get away from me, shark. Um. Still getting the other pieces. Oh, I just got bit in the face. Oh, I just got died. I just got died. I don't know where you are. Oh, is there more bits sinking than the bits I'm they're, they're, they're sinking in the water, so just hang there for a second. If I can get back there, I might be able to recover them. Roger. Um, But I don't know. I, I got most of them. There was a couple... There was like a gem and maybe a skull. Nothing crazy. Um, so I found like three chests in the water, but I don't know where they came from. Oh, those are the ones I recovered. So if I swim down there and grab them... I can pull them uh, up, see. And, then you... and then they refloat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, was it? Oh, they're it still down. Where you are. Yeah, yeah, to the right. Yep. I'm still swimming. I'm still swimming. Oh man, they're deep now. Oh, this is the captain's captain's score. That's a good one. There are now two sharks. There are three sharks around the boat. Oh yeah, no, they're 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 they want me. I might have died a little bit. Okay, cool. We are good. If you can rotate around and harpoon, I got. I was able to recover all the treasure. I, I will do so when I'm alive. Uh, I think someone in the chat just said nothing with silicon. Do you play any zombie games? Um, I used to play... So I did the Call of Duty zombie thing for a while. That was fun. Um, oh, you died. Um, yeah, I, I got eaten by a shot. Uh, so I did the Call of Duty Zombie one for a while. I uh, The one I really got into was Seven Days to Die. Um, except I played it on the Xbox, and because uh, I don't really game on the PC, just because I don't really do PC gaming much anymore. It just, not a, you know, the uh, PCs in general, I mean, keeping up with Windows and everything, I'm... I'm I use Max for my production stuff, so... Uh, Tom, can you turn right? The boat? Uh, I'm trying to turn right, but it doesn't seem to go. Do we need a bit of sail to do it, or...? Um, is the anchor dropped? The anchor is dropped, right? Yep. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 okay. So that won't let you turn it off. Oh, I don't know. So, if you turn here... So, uh, Seven Days to Die was really fun. It's, it's kind of like... Weirdly enough, it actually got me into Minecraft. Because it's very much like uh, Minecraft in the way that it works, where you can, you know, create bases and things. And I still have a really cool base on my Xbox version. Oh, uh, come on, get it. There we go. Um, so it was a lot of fun. I like that part about it. Um, and uh, they apparently are working on the newer patches and versions, so I'm hopeful that that'll be good. Um, okay, so now we need to find where the Megalodon died. Um, oh, okay, I'll go back up the mast. Uh, which is, uh, I think, over there to the right. Uh, I feel like it was on the right when we shot it. Because it's got meat that you can burn in there. <laughs> That's fair. That is fair. Uh... Nothing but silicon says I just picked up a used copy of Seven Days to Die on PlayStation. Excited to try it out. Yeah, I um, it was a little. I mean, I'm, I'm, it was a little glitchy for me. 
um, which is the problem that I had. But I had a lot of fun with it. I, would, I like dug out a, a cavern into the mountains, and it was really cool. Um, I'm going to go to left, Tom. I think that that might be it over there. I mean, I don't see it from up here, which is a bit worrying. Oh, yeah, yeah wait, wait. Yeah, you're right, left slightly. Good call, good call. Uh, pretty much straight now, and we should be able to harpoon okay. with the forward left thing. It's coming up about 75 meters forward left at the moment. Meters. There's a barrels. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that is, 75 yards, whatever. Fathoms, 12 fathoms or something. Oh, this is not uh, from the... Uh... This is a this is no, a su this is a supply run uh, chest. So this is not mm. from the. Ooh, but we got a poison ball. I like that idea. Um, I gotta stash some stuff below. So this the, you can find supply crates in the middle of the ocean, and that's what this is right here. It's one of those uh. supply crates. Um, I found some pork that's not burnt yet. That seems like should go I think, uh, I think, oh, it's back there. Okay, let me turn left. Um, so we don't know where the Megalodon stuff went. No. Uh, they should make a uh, Birds in the Sky, so I think I will shoot off in a second here. Ooh, that was a good shot. That was a good shot. You grabbed it on the ends. I, sh I got it blindly. Um, <laughs> like, I couldn't even see where it was. Alright, and then... Flammo. Yay, there we go. Sometimes I can be good at this game. Uh, Alright, so... It's getting dark. I'm gonna shoot off into the sky and see if I can see it. Because um, I think... I think it was over this way. And then we will honor our backer uh, with some fireworks as it is nighttime. Okay. Mm, didn't see anything. Oh, wait. Is that... Oh, wow. Tom, I think I lucked out. I think I found it. I think. Okay, I'll bring the ship to you, I guess. Oh, yeah. Wow. I have been lucky. I'll try not to run you over. I got no promises. There's all of the... Yeah, so it's right where I'm at right now. Roger, I'm bringing the ship to you now. Anybody who has megalophobia, I don't recommend playing this game because it is spooky in the water. Okay, the megalodon meat is sinking. It's really difficult to judge how far you are away. So if I did run you over, I apologize in advance. Oh no, you you can. Okay, I got one. I got two. No. What food do I have? I have uh, two coconuts. Oh jeez. Oh, and a shark after me. Cool. Uh, did I just lose all the? Uh, I see the loot in the water, and I'm going to try and harpoon it as soon as I get the boat in position. Alright, if I die getting this stuff, it'll be worth it, because it's Megalodon meat. <sighs> Come on, you. Okay, get the Megalodon meat. Uh, there's the last one. Yes, I got all five. Oh, nice. Oh, my mermaid's here. So if anybody doesn't know, a mermaid will take you back to your boat. Considering the boat's right here. <laughs> Alright, so we got megalodon meat. Megalodon meat is great because... Oh god, there's burnt stuff again. <laughs> um, look, okay. I might have got distracted. Bye! The fact that there was loot. It's okay. I think I got the loot. There's no fires. That's the important part. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna put the megalodon meat on the on the stove 
This stuff actually takes longer to cook, so it's got a better air of, uh... I think the only thing that's left is the thing, but I'm not sure. Uh, there's a shark in there, and there is, there is stuff that you just picked up. Okay. Oh. I think he's in the shop. Are you trying to rescue me? I am. Oh boy, I just Thank completely you. messed that up. There we go. There we go. Thank you. Okay, there is there is food on the on the stove to watch, uh, and I will take us. I don't know what you mean. I... To. We've got burnt chicken to eat. Uh oh. <laughs> I can't find our world event anymore. Um. We're live playing Seas of Thieves. What is this canon event? Says Jake. Well, it's uh, it's literally a canon, canon event. Bolt. Um, okay, so we're looking for northwest of Fetcher's Rest. Whoa, way zoomed in. Northwest. I'm not gonna lie, we're doing well on treasure, and I probably just jinxed it, but this feels like we've yep, got a lot of Yep, you've done it, you jinxed it. It's over now. I've jinxed it. <laughs> okay, northwest. Um, when we go into this battle, you want to make sure you have, um, planks. Because we're going to get hit a lot. Oh, thanks, yeah. um, and then we're going to get... Um... Oop, no, no. Don't lower that anchor. Um, northwest. Um, and then we're going to uh, need cannonballs and make sure you have plenty of food. Um, food, cannonballs, and wood. And I owe somebody some fireworks here, so I'm going to do that. Uh, another Basilicon says, uh, I pretty much have them all. Days Gone, Last of Us, Dying Light, Resident Evil. Um, which came out after us. There you go. Yay. Oh, that was a good one. Look at that celebration for another Basilicon being our background Kickstarter. If anybody else backs us on Kickstarter, we will launch some fireworks in your honor. Ooh, that was a really pretty one. Uh, we're going between the rocks. We're going between the rocks. Maybe I check on the food too. Oh, good call, good call. Um, they even made an Oregon Trail to play off the Oregon Trail. Yeah, so I, I played. I played Last of Us. I will say, um, when I played Last of Us and I got to the part where they have the yellow gas, I was kind of like. A little bummed because I was like, oh. And also, weirdly enough, um, the last one, I'm not going to give any spoilers, but the last shot in the uh, number two, um, I had already started working on Scout's Honor and I was kind of like, uh, oh, okay, kind of thing. So, um, I will say at least we did some of our things first. And I'll just, I'll just say that. Oh, there it is. There, I see the I see the uh, our cyclone now. It's over here. You think a big thing like oh, that, I wouldn't I've, lose. I think you've done the megalodon quite well, so I took it out and put it in a barrel. Okay. So Did it look brown? It looked kind of golden brown rather than the kind of burnt, crusty brown that most of the stuff that I seem to cook goes. Yeah, there's two levels of cooked with the megalodon. There's like medium cooked and fully cooked. So let's see where it's oh, at. Okay, we'll have a look. It's in the it's in the bottom barrel. Uh um, it looks kinda good. Oh that, yeah, that's that's fully put, cooked. Put it back on. That's fully cooked. We have uh let me put the uncooked ones in there too. Um and go ahead and get yourself some uh definitely get some fill yourself up with good food. Um I, for this. Uh, I'm about halfway still with good food already, yeah. Okay, so I need to get I need some meat here. Um uh, and I did play uh I did play Resident Evil. I actually played Resident Evil, like, way back in the PlayStation 2 days. Um, I think Resident Evil 2 was the first one I did. Um, and I really loved it. That was really well done. And I did Dead Island, Which too. Which one is the... Oh, Dead Island is very good. Yeah, it was really nice. glitchy, but my brother and I loved playing it, and we leveled up our characters, and, like, uh, that was our game for a, a while. Uh, Glitches and all, it was still fun. Dying, 
Dying, Dying Light, I think is the one that's parkour makes with zombies. Dying Light, that Dying Light's been up there. Um, I haven't done it because after I started doing more zombie stuff, then I sort of restricted more of my exposure. Mm -hmm. I felt like that one, from what a lot of people tell me, we share a lot of similarities. So I'm like, I yeah. don't want to... I don't yeah, want to risk this one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, so this is going to get hairy quick. So we're going into this tornado, and what's going to happen is there's going to okay. be three islands that are going to spawn. Um, and as we get to the islands, you want to steer as close to them, get me within cannon range, and make sure your sails are mostly up. There's going to be a lot of other ghost ships in the water. We, we kind of want to blow up the islands as fast as we can and almost ignore those boats. Okay, so the islands are up. So I'm going to put this one on our okay, left so side. Take the islands and avoid... Um, boats. Yeah. They will go away with three well-placed cannon shots, and I'll try and do that. I'm pretty so decent want, at it. you want it. slope passes with the sails up, and then ready for me to drop sails if I need to. Yeah, when we are... We do... We raise the sails when we get close to the island, because i got to make, like, five shots in here. I'm with you, with you, yeah. Uh, I'm going to prioritize running if we need to, basically. Okay. Oh, yeah, we're already getting hit. So we're also going to have to repair our ships every so often, too. All right, so I'm going to try and take out some of these these uh, ghost ships. It's, uh... uh go this... between the two ships. Uh, okay. Which might sound silly, but... So we've got a ship coming up on... It's going to be on the right side. Yep. Go ahead and, uh... Get us close to that island, and I think we'll be good. All right, I'm going to refill uh, on cannons. Right we currently have a, uh, a hole in the boat, but that's okay. Let's just kill this island here. So turn a little bit to the right and Roger. raise sail. Roger that. Doing so now. We're gonna get hit again. It's just gonna happen. Okay. Try and dock to keep turning. I'm gonna turn back so you can see. Sorry, my bad, my bad, my bad. All good, all good. Two shots in. Three shots in. Four shots in. Five shots. Boom. Alright, on repairs. Okay, dropping sails. All okay, right. underway again. Uh, go ahead and actually raise sails. We'll take a break here. There is, um, now that we took oh, care okay. of this island, there are some supplies that we can get from it. Oh, roger, roger. Uh, not and these that we need a lot. Because we destroyed the island, is right? Yeah, so they disappeared uh, from this island uh, portion here. Alright, so just hang here for a second. I'm going to go on that island and get us something. Roger that. Do, 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 do. I'm going to try and get the boat a little closer to the island while not crashing it. Sure. So I can pick you up easier. You may want to raise your sail a little bit. That's going to give you too much. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to hit the island. Yeah, there you go. A little bit goes a long way with the sail, I've learned. All right. Oh, did we just get one? Oh, no, we got two. Okay, cool. All right, taking all the supplies. Taking all the supplies. Don't get stuck on rocks. Harrison, you know, I was actually thinking that. I was really thinking that for a second there. Look, this is a perfect parking job. That is, and here I come for the... for the... Alright, I'm on. Uh, we go, or do you Yeah, we're go good. Again? We're good. Right. That gave us 98 Oops. cannonballs. Oh, nice. Uh, I'm heading for the next uh, thing, it's to our left. Yep. Okay. Stay on the outside. Stay away from the cyclone as much as possible if you can. That way, our the, yep. the ghost ships will stay on one side of us. Okay. Yeah, loading cannonballs and refilling my cannonballs. Okay. Cool. Doing well. All right, we got two ghost ships coming up. Another thing that I do is I'll preload the cannons and move them all the way forward because you usually fire them. The other thing that sucks is while we do this event, there are other ships that can come onto us, but we'll just we'll just play it by ear so far. We'll deal we'll deal with it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um hang hang to your right a little bit. Put the uh, island on your left. Yeah, there, perfect. Um so far so good with the uh, the ghost ships out there. I think I was able to take out one. 
So when you blow up an island, do they disappear and reappear on the next island? Is that? Yeah. Well, they. I think they. There's like nine of them. But then once we take care of all three islands, the uh, hurricane will go away. Or excuse me, the cyclone. Um, and then yeah. we'll have to attack a big fort in the middle that has a lot of points you have to shoot. So it'll get a little right. tough there. Um, and uh, honestly, it's hard to shoot, but I'm decent on cannons. I think, I think we got it. And if not, we're, yeah. we're, doing, we're doing well. That's what excitement and adventure is about. Uh, nothing but silicon says honestly I put we're alive up there with the best of them I'm shocked someone hasn't reached out about buying the rights as a TV show at least a comic book series Yeah, we may, we may do stuff like that once the series is over um, I more or less uh, Focus on the audio side uh, And I do think that Scouts Honor is one of those yeah race sales uh, is one of those one stories that I think puts some of the best of a series forward so uh, Where are my cannibals going? Uh, you go far on the left of it. Oh yeah, I've, I've, I'm, I'm, oh shoot. It's a good spot, we can stay here. I know we're uh, getting hit. Gosh. Got it, okay, cool. On repairs now. Uh, yeah, so one day. There's a lot of other mediums that we can jump to where alive with. Uh, one of the fun things about having Rusty Quill as a as a partner. All right, Tom. <laughs> Sorry, what's that? I heard my name. What? I was I was saying uh, one of the the nice things about having a partner on this is having someone who can help with the uh, the adaptations and all that fun stuff. So. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. My my focus has always been on doing the uh, the audio show. And uh, once I can focus on other aspects of the uh, of the IP afterwards, then we can we can do some more fun stuff in other mediums. Uh, but we are working on a book right now um, that's going to come out after season two of Descendants. Uh, that's going to focus on some family stuff, uh, and we've been working on that. Uh, Lisa, Brian, and I have been working on that for a long time now. It's just taken a taken a long time just to get that done, and also it can't come out before. Season two uh, is over, um, so that's been also one of the, the delays for it because we're not. There's stuff that gets revealed in the series that has to get revealed there first before it goes onto the book. Uh, Sabrina says the whole yacht scene got me excited because I thought it was going to be, uh, it was going to be a connection. Then I can't remember if the characters from the beginning we met are the same location as scouts. Um, so they're on Catalina, and that boat was uh, in Marina del Rey. So it's a little, little different location, but. Um, a lot of people have theorized that there might be a, a connection there, so we'll see. Oh, we got a boat on the side. So this is where I get to practice my long, my long, oh shoot, I'm out of cannibals. Well, at least it happened now. Uh, we're coming up a little bit on the island, so I'm going to start reading the tales. Okay. A World Live movie would be fantastic. I agree. I don't know, maybe, a, I think the TV series would give us more to work with. Um, rather than a, uh, uh, a movie seems quick, but I understand movies might be easier to do. Uh, it's it's really interesting to see how you know certain shows do while TV shows. Um, movies sometimes get better budgets. So I don't know. We'll see. Oh, there we go. We just got hit. Lowest deck is all good, Captain. All right. Let's get to the uh, to the uh, very center. The, uh, the, the big fort has, has appeared. Reloading cannibals. So hang a right and bring us around. There's a chest out there, but I don't think I'm going to get close to it. Uh, nope. Oh, what's what? Right down? Down, 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 down. Yeah, no, no, it's okay. This, it's a nothing chest. It's just more supplies. We got plenty. So go ahead and hang a left. Roger that. So that was a very ambitious shot if that hits anything. Ah. Uh... Like That's a. I mean, that oh, it gets hit. close. <laughs> <laughs> it, got, it got pretty close in there. Alright, so hang to the right because most of our pirate ghost ships are on the left. 
So we want to yeah, yeah. so we want to hang on their their, their 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 side. Um, but then make your way to the uh, island. Uh, hang a left. I see you. This one is going to be unavoidable. But if you put it on my right, I'll I'll sink it. All right, Just ready now, and man. one, two, three. There it goes. Nice, nice, nice. Whoa. I yeah, if they, when they blow up, they uh, they tend to rock your boat. All right, go ahead and get us close. I serious is uh, Harrison says a Harry's is way better because you can do a lot more. I agree. You can't fit everything from we're alive in a movie. Yeah, you're gonna miss out a lot of character moments, and I also think that you know movies are the reason why people like series more now is you get to spend more time with your characters um, rather than kind of rushing through things. And but you know movies in themselves can are sometimes more efficient in the storytelling. So it really depends on the on what you're telling. Uh, I'm raising sails here. Perfect. All right, got that one down. I'm going to turn you slightly so you can see the... Thing. Yeah, so anything that's glowing green is what we're shooting at. I'm going to run out of cannons here real quick. Uh, we are... All right, I got... Right. Yeah, you have to turn. turn. Uh... Okay, I'm going to... I'm gonna drop sail. Yes, moving. Just so we, that's moving. Yeah, just just a little bit. Just a little bit is all we need. Oh Put no! I'm out of range. Idiot. Out of range. Um, yeah, I'm. Uh, it's all under control. <laughs> <laughs> he says. It's okay. It gave me time to repair. Because uh, we're getting hit. We're getting pummeled. Got some yeah, big yeah, holes I'm, down uh, here. I'm gonna turn us around. All good. All good. We definitely have enemy ships next to us as well. I'm I got one shot in. Around the island. Yeah, yep, that's gonna happen. Come on, hit. Oh, what a shot. We are going very fast. I'm raising sail because I don't want to go into the back of this guy. Um, it's quite fun the fact there's uh, multiple like things you gotta do at the same time. It's good. It's... Yes. Uh, I'm bringing the left cannon to bear, and I can. Okay, I'm. I'm. Well, I got. I got holes. I'm just trying to keep us. Uh, keep us afloat. We can take a, a good amount of cannon hits on on this this ship, as long as we can tend to them fairly easily. All right. Uh, okay, we're good. And um, I'm gonna try and get you around the islands to the far side. Yeah, because that's where uh, that's where all of our destructors are now. Ooh, good hit. Good hit. That top one's pretty hard to hit. Oh, now I'm just too too high, too high. Okay, I'm we're too low. Come on, hit. I'm gonna just take ground at this point. I think you're not gonna be able to hit over the top of the thing, right? Yeah, I don't think I will, but I'm gonna keep on trying. Yeah. So I was adjusting our sails a little there's bit. That, there's that little top piece. You hit something. That just took some I think I killed a ship on the other side. <laughs> Maybe. I, I, it's hard to tell. Uh, okay, I feel like I wanna uh, get going a little quicker. Oh, no, no, actually, we're not getting hit by these guys. We will be. And also, the longer that we take, the more uh, other people can find us. I'm really here with you. Okay, I'm going to lower the sound. There we go. Okay, don't have a shot. Turn them more to your right if you can. Roger. Okay, there. It's getting harder to hit some of these. Uh, I'm just, Sorry, just, I'm, uh... just too high. All right, I'm going to have to get on repairs. I think we've there got we... too many holes. Is 
There might be comments right now, and I cannot read them. <laughs> uh, we're gonna need to move because we're surrounded at the minute. So I'm, I'm legs, quite a lot of sail out. Sure, do what you need to do. I do will. Uh, I will keep us afloat. Um, here we go. Okay, island. Time to meet your. Alright, I'm, uh, I'm bringing you back towards the island now. I'm getting some good long range shots in. I think I've gotten it a couple times. Nice. I'm gonna kind of stick on this angle if I can. Come on, come on! I'm, I'm just, I'm just, at, so I'm just out of. Yep. Okay. Hang here if we can. I have got sail fully up. Uh, there's, there's a ship on the other side. I'm gonna try and sink while you. Uh, sure. Uh, that. We, uh, I need a little bit to the right. I just lost my shot. Oh, wow. All right, getting there, getting there, getting there. We're almost, we're almost through this. Oh boy. I'm not making it easy for you here, I'll be honest. No, you're good, you're good. Nice, nice. Yes! I think that's it. Yeah! I apologize to anyone in the like comments that was saying anything during that, but I was not paying attention. It was a bit too stressful. No, oh. no, that was uh, that was a lot. Okay, now if we see any boats, we're in bad shape because that means they're not ghosts. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. Uh, what do we need to do to loot? Do we need to go where the ghosts are? That yep. Before? So where those ghosts are circling right now, I'm going to get over there and put the loot on the on the rim. Uh, so I can shoot with the harpoon. Yep, that's the idea. Uh, okay, looking okay. good, looking good. I've gotten this loot before and literally had a had a boat like turn up right as I'm grabbing it. Cause this is a this is right here, uh, some of the best loot in the game. Roger that. Uh, everything's looking good. Everything's looking good. I think if we if we can get this loot back here, I think that might be the the end of our stream because that's a good uh, good two hour mission right there. Fair. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to say how it's going until you know we finish because. <laughs> yes, yes. If we have to recover our loot from <laughs> something. Oh shoot! I forgot uh, okay. something. The ship is the ship is should be stationary -ish now. Okay, so I forgot something. Yep. I need to grab a. I need to grab an empty chest because there's usually a whole bunch of stuff to fill into it. Okay, there we go. Alright, keep an eye out for any boats. Uh, Let me gonna, know if you see any. Roger that. I'm going to turn the ship around a bit to get us so that we're better at taking advantage of the harpoon and wind if we need it. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so I don't see anything yet. So far, so good. No ships, no ships. All right, there's there. This right here is the uh, the mega chest, the chest of legends. One of the best chests in the game. It used to be the best, but then uh, they have since have more. Um, I see something at the distance to our. East, southeast. Yep. It's got glowing lights on it. That is a pirate ship. That's okay. okay uh, a, a, a skeleton ship. Excuse me. Uh, you can yeah. start harpooning this stuff if you can. If you can. Roger. 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 Hmm? A bit high. A bit high. Uh, Viceiver okay. is asking, what's my Switch username? 
Uh, pretty much all my usernames are Wayland Prode in some denomination. W A Y L E N D P R O D. Uh, the only one on uh, Xbox here is just Casey Wayland. Because when I was filling out my uh, registration for Xbox Live, I thought when they said name, they meant my name. And I never changed it. I think that's a thing of our age, because I did exactly the same thing back in the day. I've, not, I've since changed it, but when I started, it was uh, my, my real name was my, was my gamer tag. Yeah, I mean, it's... I've been I've been on Xbox Live since Xbox 360 came about. Um, way back the very very first Xbox 360. I did I did like that system. I still have an Xbox 360. I just because a lot of the uh, a lot of the games aren't available um, now. It is, it when you're back, I'll let you, you take over the half because I'm failing to shoot you very well. Okay. It I might be that we're in a bad angle, too. Let's see. Oh, yeah, it's right behind a light. Uh, I'll jump up and grab some bits. Yeah, we need to go just forward just a little bit. It's it's right behind the... Uh, the what do you call it? Oh, you're moving it? Oh, we just need to move the boat forward just a tiny bit. Oh, oh well, that, that's much more sensible. I was going to do it the slope way, apparently. Yeah, because leaving it right there, I oh, think, is going to be probably the, the best bet. As long as we can... Oh, now i got to turn the boat. Oh, no. We are vulnerable. We're vulnerable. <laughs> okay, so maybe turn to the right just a little bit more, but then slow it up so that it stays in my range. Okay, there we go. Oops. We still haven't got the, the, the good chest. The good chest is still sitting right there. Oh no, I'm, I'm telling you. Uh, Are you in range? Yeah, I'm, I'm in range. You don't have to move anymore. It's just bouncing around okay, so gonna, much I'm, right now. I'm gonna swim over there, and if you've got it by the time you, I can we just leave. Yep, then I can get you back, yep. Yep. Wow, okay. I like the idea that some pirates turn up right now just to see us doing this. Just like, oh boat gosh. full of loot, but can't get the one chest that we want. And... Okay, I think, I think I've gotten the big ones here. Okay, here. Uh, there's that one. You got that one? Doesn't Don't really. Make a bigger target out of it like that. Uh. Oh, how about I throw it in the pool? Oh, there we go, you got one. Um. Oh, you're a bit low. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's like by the time I which, shoot which, it, it's changed. Which... Oh, that's good. That's good. Uh, is that it just? It just. And then... Is it's that it? it? And then get me! Get me! Yeah. Okay, you got the skull out of my hand. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, All right. All right. All right I'll here. give you the bearing to get us out of here. Oh boy, that was a lot. Alright, so we want to go to Galleon's Grave Outpost, so head northwest and be on the very big northwest. lookout for any, uh, uh, anybody else. What is that? Alright, we got the Veilstone. Here we go. So, when we get to the other end, what stops them just taking it off our ship? Um, well, we're, that's why we're going to go to the outpost to turn it all in now. Right, right, right. Well, I'm when we get to the outpost, what stops them stealing off our ship? Oh, they can very easily if people are there, but that's why you don't pull into an outpost if you see anyone. Okay, so northwest, so head straight now. Alright, the outposts are uh, especially dangerous because that's where everyone goes to turn in stuff, and if everyone has turned in their loot, what ends up happening is uh, they'll all be kind of waiting for you. 
I see. Is that giant skull in the sky a thing that we should worry about? Uh, no, that is a, um, a skelly fort. Alright, so... Through the mist, I don't see anybody. Looks good. Okay, so keep heading towards that island that looks like it has that little... mast on top. And we're gonna we're gonna pull up right to that thing that's on the right hand side. I'm trying to get a view of what you mean. Oh, I see the big pointy island. Yep. Sort of forward and left. That's it. Okay. All right, I'm gonna put that chest separate. I'm currently stacking up all of our loot in the middle. Uh, there's our trident. We'll put that back here. Actually, I'll just leave that there. That's fine. Alright, put all this stuff. I was about to say, so whoever said, I wish I had this game, it's cool. Uh, it's on Xbox Game Pass, so if you do have a PC and you get Game Pass, it's, it's free. They're also Although doing... Obviously you have to pay for the Game Pass. So. They're also doing a huge amount of improvements to the game. I mean... When I first started this game, you could only eat bananas and dig up chests, and it was it, there was n no harpoons. Like, as the game has gone on, they have done a lot to really make this uh, game a lot better. Um, uh, and the next iterations are going to be incredible too. They are um, doing harpoon guns and all kinds of crazy stuff. I was going to say, I played it once or twice back when it first came out, and it was nothing like this. This is way more ridiculously... I mean, it, yeah, exciting is basically the best way to so. it. Yeah, they have a lot... I mean, there is a um, lot more... They, they, it used to be um, a lot more slower paced, and um, they and there was, you know, cheaters too, and they've done a really great job of, like, in, installing an anti-cheat system now. So I, I, I am... Um, I'm very appreciative of, of how much they've done for this game. Am I, am I looking at the wrong island? I might be looking at the wrong island. I'm looking at the wrong island. Is the island to the right that you want me to go to, right? Um, yes, directly to your right. So, hard... Okay. Hard to starboard. Hard to starboard, roger that. And we're going to go around the back side of the island where that little pole thing is. That's where we turn in our treasure. Um, if you have a captain to vessel, that's where you uh, you take it. Uh, so opposite side of the island to where we are, is that right? Yes. Roger that. Like, just the fact that they have storage chests and everything that you can store things from, very helpful. And uh, there's, there's like mermaid hideouts and everything, all that. Yeah, so we need to go around to the other side of the island, so... Uh, Roger, I'm gonna go to the, the, to the right of it, and then left is my plan. Perfect. Yeah, we're heading towards that thing that has the little flags on the back. So, oh, I see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 we got something behind us. Enemy? Uh, potential. Very big sail. Move fast. Roger that. It's a galleon. Um, we need to basically do a drop anchor in a minute. All right. So when we get round, we drop anchor and just come to a quick salt and drop. Yep, yep. Turn, 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 turn. Off. Turning. Uh, do we just ram the dock or stick like to the side of it? Uh, Parkus, right. Here. Should be fine. And there's another boat off, sure. off in that direction, too. Okay, so now come. Do, do uh, stay in the boat for just a minute. Just leave it in the boat. Uh, stay in the boat for just a minute. Because um, we got to do this fast. Because we have somebody right on our tail. Let's make it real ugly, real quick. Oh, you're going to harp you off. I see. Right, 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 yeah. right. right. Um, uh, okay, bring, bring, okay, bring it I'm closer. I'm gonna come forward slightly. 
Yep, you're gonna have to raise your anchor before you do that. Good pull, thank you. Maybe I'll just stop it. There we go, I'm gonna turn so you can get it all. Nice. Okay, get uh get underneath me and start turning stuff into there's a guy on the on the on the dock right here underneath me. And start take, giving it to him. Uh Roger, I'm on the way. Like in a in a tough spot. I'm gonna start turning in with you. Uh, I don't think I've seen this much treasure in the history of my entire experience with this game. So I feel. Like <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I think yes. Yeah, so that comes with having a seasoned captain. I'm getting, I'm getting trying to get to the uh, the good chest here. I love the idea that they can up and shoot us just as we like. Yeah. Oh no, there's there's our firework chest. Don't want to turn that one in. Oh, did I do that already? No, you're fine. Okay. Yeah, we just let them off, right? There we go, chest of legends, finally. When you've got a load of loot in a box, does it hand in everything that's in the box? Is that yeah, it, you can. That's a, that's a newer thing that they've been doing, uh, which I really like, so that we don't have to offload everything. You can you can get rid of it all very quickly. Uh, now there's some still some stuff on our boat that I couldn't get to because it's behind the harpoon, but at least where is that? Everything is uh, most everything is off the boat that's of, of importance. Oh, actually, I think the bag. It's a whole bunch of really good stuff. Uh, do I pull the boat to try and get as close to the thing as I can? I think maybe uh, that's a good plan. I'm gonna... Sure... I'm just gonna try and put it up here. Oh, you're gonna try and harpoon it? Okay. Yeah, because uh, those other two boats are real close to us right now. Uh, here, try and move this stuff close... Yeah, there you go. I'll, I'll start harpooning. Yeah, yeah. Because we're gonna... I have a feeling that they may already be here. If they were if they were coming up on us, the, the brig would have caught up to us by now. Or the galleon. I mean, they might have also looked and thought, oh, they probably got all their loot in, because they don't know that we're messing around with harpoons. Yep, yep, so that's, that is a thing that could happen. Yes, uh, I, like, gonna, I like the fact that the quest kind of takes you on a, on a chain of adventure where you get lots of treasure from different places. Yeah, that's oh, that's this is uh, the one of the Athena voyages. So you can only play these if you get to a certain level um, after a while. So and also turning in loot like this is uh, for captain ships, not for so you have to buy a ship to be able to turn in here. But it really oh, does okay. make things faster for turning in. So it's it's almost like a quality of life. Because for the longest time, we had to take off our treasure one at a time. Right. And it took it took like 45 minutes sometimes to offload if you had a boat full of stuff. Oh, you okay. scared the crap out of me. I thought there's that was somebody more. else. No, 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 it's me. Uh, there's more over there, by the way, to grab it. Okay. Put it in a I'll, uh, I'll harpoon more. Uh, stay down there for a second. Oh, I did. That one treasure got us like... 8,000. I don't know what, what, how much money you have, but... So, I had 
when we started this whole adventure, I had 55,000. I currently have 170,000 or something ridiculous. <laughs> there you go. You've, you've, you know, quadrupled my money or something. It was a good investment. Yeah. Uh, oh, I mean, okay, it wasn't so fun, which is the main thing. There. Oh, there's that boat. Uh, and then there's the uh, there's the other one. That one is a a sloop over there. I think our what we should uh, do is go after that Skelly ship. Yeah, a bit of a Barney. That sounds a good idea. All right, here are the fireworks to harpoon back because we will keep them. So I'll drop them in the water. Oh, before you go back to the boat, Makes let's sense. go lower our uh, our emissary. So follow me. Okay, okay. So what emissary is is emissary is basically like a um, a multiplier for your loot depending on how long you've been doing it. And because we got right. emissary but level five, yeah, we uh, we got a multiplier. And then now when we lower our sales, or lower that, you'll get even more money for that. Mm. And also some reputation. Yep, so I'm now at 220,000 gold from 55. I feel that that was quite successful. I might be able to I... buy myself a new peg leg or whatever I need. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And where is the, the creative fireworks? Because we're going to set all these off on our way. Uh, Alright, let's get going and find some pirates to blow up. So, when we get out, we'll hang a left. Because I saw a big three... three boat to our left over here. Roger that. Oh, I see it. Yeah, yeah. And we're going to go after that. Now, this is a small boat against a very large boat. So, yeah. Things, things might not work out well it, for right? us. Yeah, try, but it's going to get it's going to get hairy. I already know it's going to be. Uh so thank you all for joining us for the stream. Um if you don't know, we are currently uh running a Kickstarter for our last two seasons of Descendants. Um if you back us, we will um and let us know in the chat, we will send up some more fireworks in your honor. Matter of fact, Let's let's uh, let's do this again for our um, our associate producer. Nothing but silicone. Um, all right, let's load this up. Ooh, the veil of ancient fireworks. This will be a good one. So to our backer. Ooh, that was a pretty one. Oh, nice. Lots of colors. Again, we're clearly doing this to strike fear into the pirates around us. Oh, very much so. Enough to sail around, firing fireworks into the air. It's a, uh, it's a big move. <laughs> uh, what, what do we get? Oh, just 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 some extra stuff here. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put. We have a lot of cooked food down there. I don't know what I'm eating. Uh, just petty stuff. Is there it on fire? Because I, I feel if the one thing I've learned today is when I if just before the stream I said I've been watching <laughs> Don't worry, I now know how to cook really well. I think what we've discovered is when I get distracted, I don't. So there we go. Yeah. Oh look, there's another boat off there to the right. Oh, that's that's that galleon that I was worried about. That's the player galleon over there. Uh, but we're gonna go after the Skelly galleon because that'll be this will be more fun. Yeah. The player galleon, uh, there's, there's, we don't, we don't stand a chance. They, they I mean, likely, yeah, I was about to say they like to mess us up. We may not stand a chance against this one too, but uh, hey, we'll see. Let's find out. I think, look, I think we've come out, we've overcome all of the obstacles we've come up against so far. Uh, I'm confident that we will overcome this one. Oh yeah. Or, or die, one or the other. We're actually, we're looking good, because it seems to be going left to right, right? So we're actually going to end up behind it, I think. With it on our right cannon. Okay. So what I'm going to do... Cannonball create... Okay, so I'm going to take a whole bunch of cannonballs. There's and... loot, loot in the water to the left, but I don't really think we care about loot. But there you go. Oh, Wonder Teller. I don't know why loot. We have another backer, Wonder Teller. Put some fireworks for me, bro. Awesome. Yes. Uh, let's do it. We'll send up two for you. There we go. For Wonder Teller. 
Boom! Little mask stranger there. And another ancient veil. Thank you, Wonder Teller. Thank you very much for the support. Oh, this is... You know what? Wonder Teller, you get one more. Because this one's really awesome. Um, we're nearly on that pirate ship. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounded impressive. Still going. All right. Thank you, Wonder Teller. Oh, one for... Oh, Harrison wants one, too. I will send one up before you, Harrison, in just a moment. Well, that was pathetic. Okay, there we go. Going forwards, uh, so, yeah, I'm going, I'm going after him. And I'm going to probably end up on the left cannon. Okay. I'm gonna... do I have a... I don't have any more fireworks. Because if we sink, I want to send up one... Yeah, this, this. Okay, scratch that. They're gonna be on the right cannon. We're gonna cross the T. That's for you, Harrison. Right. That's the thing. I remember from when I was at school studying naval. I will launch uh, another one for you in a minute. <laughs> Sorry we didn't watch it. Oh, am I... I'm firing a flare at the ship. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, hit them with the, hit them with the fireworks. Oh, oh, careful of those kegs. Yeah, There's a keg in the water. Steer clear of those Probably kegs. Wish they would have hit them. That would have been okay. great. Okay, this Here's is going to get ugly. I'm going to try and get in front of them. Yep. I'm going to try and keep them off cannons. Don't know how well that's going to work. Throwables. Die! Oh, I just threw that at us. <laughs> uh, there we go. I just shot a skeleton on a cannon. Stop shooting yourself. I'm bringing us around the left cannon if I can, so we're doing a bit of a circle. Uh, okay. Uh, we set them on fire quite well, I think. Oh, yeah. Uh, we hit them pretty good. Oh, no way. No way. Did we sink them? I think we might have done. What? That was too easy. So, we, we well, I mean, it's not easy. We, we, we shot them at cannons a lot and then threw loads of fireworks on their ship. Clearly, that was yeah, happening. that's fair. Oh, we're also, we're also, uh, got water coming we in. We might be sinking. Hold on, yeah, I just added water to our mess. Fix. Yeah, if your bucket is filled, you'll uh, you'll add water. Uh, that's something I just did accidentally. Uh, where'd they hit us? Ah, here we are. I don't see the hole. I was gonna say, okay. It was on our in our uh, back uh, side. Okay, so. Uh, I'll be honest. I lost track of where we sunk him. Yeah, let me raise sail here. I'll have to send up a uh, a firework for for Harrison. Maybe that'll that'll help us light the way. Don't have any. Nope, I don't have any. Uh, cannibals. Here we go. All right, we got ooh Rathborn's riches for Harrison. Here we go. Ooh. Boom. Ooh, look at that. That's a pretty one. Good selection, Harrison. <laughs> oh, isn't it pretty? Um, That's very pretty. All right, where, where, where's I want? Uh, I'm going to go up top take a look. Uh, I will say that I believe the... Um, oh, oh, hi. Uh, I believe that it is easier to sink those now. I don't see it at all. Yeah, neither do 
time. Maybe we didn't sink it. Maybe it was a submarine. Uh, Actually, <laughs> it can it can despawn, but we got the music, I think, saying that we sank. Yeah, I think it went down. It looked like it sank. It, it's definitely not going to be close I... to this island, so let's let's move a little bit out this way and and look around. Oh wait, there's, there's some there. there's some seagulls behind us. Okay, That's the only one I see. Uh, I'll scan the skies. There's another sloop over there. If nothing else, maybe we can go up against that sloop next. Is that a pirate sloop? Uh, no, sorry, a pirate. A, a, uh... a player, yeah. As a player? Ooh. Yeah. Okay, head straight. There's, there's, uh... Straight, yep, there's two... I'll check out the one on the left, uh, and then you keep going this way. I believe it's gonna be that one on the right, but we'll find out in a second. I'll go up top. So stay on the oh, yeah, 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 stay yeah, on the helm. Sounds, of course, yeah. Not that we don't have plenty of loot already, but hey, if they uh, if this player sinks us, oh, uh, Vesever, Vesever wants a firework. How about, uh, uh, you can pick this time, Tom? Oh, okay. I'll go and find some fireworks. Hang on. Uh, cannonball crate. Fire, Athena's firework crate is what I... uh, We've got something here called a Dragon's Breath Firework. Ooh, Dragon's Breath good. Firework. Uh, it's the right one, this. I that one. Hang on. Oh, Strong button. Get it off. You can tell I'm not an expert at fireworks. Uh, I'm just turning. Okay, a slow dragon's breath firework. Alright, there's Tom loading the firework. Same up. Boom. Here's for you, receiver. Yeah! Ooh, yeah. that one's got crackles. Oh, it's like sparkly. I like that firework. That was a good one. Uh, why don't we do one more for our, our two backers that just did, uh, uh, just came on. Why not? What is that? And, uh, we've lost our treasure, but I don't care. I, you know, whatever. We've got something called a Chanting Viper. Ooh, Enchanting firework. Viper. Got a few of them. We'll uh, load these up. Maybe I load one in each side. That sounds good. Ooh. Simple plan. Oh wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me get, me get up. Ready? Three, okay. two, one. Two, one. Oh, that's cool. I think that was the right firework to use both hands. Yeah, no kidding. It's because it's a, it was a viper. It just. <laughs> Streamed out. That was cool. As we hit a rock, not hitting that rock at all. Oh, I didn't hit that rock. <laughs> all right. I didn't even see the rock. All right. Uh, the Seaver says thank you. You guys are awesome. Uh, well, thank you for joining us. This has been a lot of fun. Uh, I think we're gonna go until just a little bit longer. Uh, there's a there is a boat out here. We're gonna try and make contact with... I lost which direction it was, though. Uh, I'll go have a look in the, from the crow's nest. I think it might be in front of us, but I might be imagining it. Oh, no, right behind us. Oh, right behind us? Well, that's not a good sign, is it? Do, 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 do. I see it on the horizon there. Najak says, uh, see see good the choice, sale, yeah. Tom. Oh, cheers. I am quite liking this uh, streaming Sea of Thieves thing. I mean, I think it's, uh, it's a, it was a good choice for today. Oh, I've enjoyed it. Hopefully, other people have enjoyed watching it. It's a it's a very fun game. Like, it's also very like relaxing too until you're getting sunk. I'll, I'll be honest. 
there's been a few heart pounding moments today that I found quite intense, but in a good way. Like fighting that fort as a good example was quite, quite cool. Yeah, that's oh, that's that's one of the reasons I chose that mission because I knew if we got to the end there, it would be really fun and uh, pretty exciting and and not undoable too with two people. Yeah. yeah. So like, I, I think I see the sail of the guy that we're looking at, and he's. Mm -hmm. Unless I'm imagining it, but you straight ahead to the right of that island in the distance, is that the one you're looking at? Yep. Alright, so before we get there, you need what we call PvP food. So you need to load up and right. eat meat. Right. Um, so that you have... Let's make sure... Okay, cool. I am at, uh, I'm at maximum right now. Um, hey, is there a way to check? Oh, I've got some, I've got some good meat on me, actually. Okay, so, uh, let's see, I got full cannons, I got two of those, um, if someone was to donate now, we'd have to expose ourselves in terms of, uh, putting a firework real close to this guy, <laughs> so, hey, if that happens, I have, uh, I have a firework ready, um, if, if anybody, uh, I don't know if you're gonna be able to cook it in time. No, 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 there's some cooked stuff. I'll oh, just eat the cooked stuff. There you go. No. Yeah, eat, eat the cooked stuff if you have it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, cool, cool. We'll leave the uncooked stuff, because here's the thing. If they board us, they'll go after our food, and then we just give them the good food. Um, I found some cannonballs earlier that I was saving for a special occasion. I'm going to put them in the top cannonball, but I found some a limp ball and a rigging ball. Oh. I don't, I don't know if either of them are helpful. Yes, those these are called cursed cannonballs. They're getting more and more rare in the game. Oh, 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 Tom, there's a keg right there. That's right there. I am, uh, I am really big into shenanigans. Um, so okay. we're gonna have some fun. Um, so, it is always a risk to bring an explodey barrel onto your boat, but we're gonna do it. Sounds good to me. So, I'm gonna bring this over here. Um, and, uh, hopefully we don't lose this guy. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these in our mast. If we get hit in the mast, our mast will explode. But that's okay. Okay. It'll rain down fire. Oh, don't, don't raise anchors. Oh, you have your sail up. You're good. Never mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are two back I there. I did the sail for two. Oh, that's I did that for two reasons. Because one, with the sail up, it's less easy for him to see us, right? And two, I could then raise the anchor ready to go. Um, do you want me to just set sail straight away again? Um, there's another keg. Oh, okay, I'll stop then. Oh, sorry. Oh, are they coming towards us? No, 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 no. That's, that's... Um, there is a, another keg out there that I was going to go grab, because there's two. Why have uh, okay. one when you can have two? So, in case we get into a, a battle and I have to jump off and go onto his ship and set that off. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Tom, don't hold it again, says Harrison. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no, giving me, giving me barrels. Uh, like, if we get there and they have moved, do we just sneak on board with a couple of barrels and blow it up? Yeah, no, that, so we're not gonna, we're not gonna go and, uh, we're not gonna cannonball them. We're gonna okay. come under the guise of we're nice. Um, right. and we'll still be quiet as we approach. Um, yep. but then I'll just jump off, go put a keg on their boat, and then, um, and then you can turn the boat around, uh, and come after them. Roger, Roger, that makes sense. Okay, so we have our... Keep the boat in a sensible position, basically. Yep. yep. So we have our kegs. We're ready to go first, mate. Roger that, aren't we? Uh, probably have to turn around, because I think that he's behind us now. Is he? Yeah. Am I looking at the wrong ship? Isn't he in front of us? Uh, do we have another ship in front of us? I think you're looking at the wrong boat. Oh. I'm pretty sure they're behind us. But I'll... Okay, I'm turning. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, you're right, you're right. There is one over there. Hang a right. Hang a right. You're... Maybe there's two, but I... That would make sense that there are two of them. Okay, so I'm going to prepare our cannons. Just move behind a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. So they might just coming a bit, which would be better. Yeah, no, I like that idea. Um, alright, so I'm going to load these cannons. Yeah, so go to the... Yeah, keep to the left of that island. Okay, what what is this island coming up? Okay, he's there. Okay, so 
Go ahead and cross. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go straight for him. Yeah, I think there's that's no there's no other way around it. All right, so I'm gonna go up into our mast and um, grab a, a a keg. We are into the wind here, so we're gonna be quite slow approaching him, unfortunately. That's fine. It's okay. So just do do a drive by, and then loop around. Yeah. All right. Uh, if he talks to us, I'll say hi, and I'll just be polite at him. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go radio silent. I'm muting my mic. Now I'm radio silent, so they can't hear me in the game. But I can still talk to you in the chat. So that way it's not completely silent. All right. So ooh, my heart's starting to go a little bit. Sneaking up on this. The boat hasn't started moving. They don't see us yet. All these creaking boats up here in the mast. Okay. This person's probably on the island somewhere. So. Tom, steer me. Get me closer. There. He heard, he heard me. I don't know if he, maybe he's listening to the stream right now. All right. I don't see any. Okay. I don't see anybody running around. I don't see any of the gamer tags. Well, this isn't going to be very. Oh, wait. Do I see someone on their boat? We're in the water. I kind of feel bad. He doesn't have much treasure. I mean... We've done such a good job sneaking up on them, though. <laughs> so, we did that for the lulls. I'm going to start patching your ship. Alright, alright, alright. Let's go and help him. We'll actually become friendly. Yeah. Thomas coming over to help. Maybe we can cook his food while he's here, and that, that won't be wrong. We were just having a bit of fun. Hello. We're here to help. Don't panic. We double double patch that one. Any more holes? Uh, I think I think that's it. Okay. Oh, these are some pretty good king's chests. Nice. Pretty nice. Well, pleasure to meet you. We just wanted to have a little bit of fun with the keg. So, uh, did we uh, yep. need sorry, to sorry repair, for the damage. repair the mast? Banana. They have banana on their mast. That's pretty funny. Oh, we didn't check the name of the ship. What's the name of the ship? The Starfish. Oh, that's a cool name. Oh, oh, Tom. Everything is okay. Everything's okay. Okay, cool. Well, we have another uh, another ship over there that we can go after now. So, uh, cheers. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. I mean, for some of you in so solo slooping, I, you know, I, I couldn't do that. Look, we, yeah, we, we, we proved the point that we have the capacity to do it, and then we were nice to try and help. And they were very nice to not shoot us, so overall it was a win, and everyone's a lot happier for it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, where's this other ship that we're looking at? Uh, hang off, to, hang, a, hang a right after we get out of here. You'll see it. Off to the right. right. Cheers! Bye! There's a rowboat right down there on the shore you may want to get. Anyway. 
Yeah, I, I, that, when I saw their boat, I was like, they're 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 newer to the game. It's it, yeah. I'm not that kind of pirate. Hey, hey, look! I feel that we did the right job. If we did a training exercise for them of how, like, you know, what can go wrong. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should make an alliance with them. Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. We're not going to be streaming for much longer. Just go ahead and hang a left. It's off to your left. Left slightly. There it goes. Up. Yep, I see it. It's a skelly, but that's okay. I think uh, I think once we conquer the skelly, that'll be a, maybe the good time to to call it a day. Fair. We've gotten a two and a half hours oh, in there. Be yeah, sneaking up on that last boat was uh, was quite entertaining because it was just like right, be quiet. Like, this is going too well. I, I feel we should be spotted and shot at by now. Yeah, no, I. Uh, oh, you know what? How close can you get me? Because I <laughs> maybe I can sneak onto the ship of the skellies with a uh, a keg. I'm I'm game. I'm game. I will try and get you close. Just gonna adjust the sails a bit. Oh, oh, great. Right. Oh, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, hang on. Yeah, I'm gonna do this a bit. All right. Oh, they're turning towards us. This is great. That's good. That's good. That's good. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try not ram them, but like get you as close as I can. Oh, go, go left. Go left. They're turning. They're turning. I'm doing it. Yeah, yeah, I see, I see. Because uh, they'll they'll speed away very very they'll quickly. Try or the, so they won't do anything until we stop them at all. Oh no, they also have this like thing where they tend to go a little bit faster than we do. Arrgh. Sorry. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this keg on the boat. I was having to use the the, the wind a bit as best as I can. Oh no, that makes sense. Doesn't seem like we're gonna catch them. Oh, 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 um, we That's might have a second ship. Are we being ambushed by skeletons? We might be being ambushed. Yep, yep, yeah, we're getting ambushed. To the right. Okay, steer into them. Good idea, good idea. Hang on. This might get a bit crashy. That's okay. Oh, they're gonna go left side. I might have mis mismanaged it a bit. Oh no, 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 no! Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on! Uh, oh no! They shot me! Uh, the, the, the bastard shot yes. me! Yes! Okay, so keep, keep and, the... And it's a bit on fire. Okay, so keep the, keep the boat afloat. Um, go patch some holes if you can. Um, and I will be back as soon as I possibly can. That's the risk of, uh... So how do I... Just keep how us afloat. On fire? There we go. I'm not on fire anymore. There we go. The good thing is, as we're taking on water, <laughs> you won't be on fire, fire anymore. On fire, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm coming back. Uh, here we go, here we go. That was crazy, going after them and all of a sudden... Another champ. Yep. Oh, this is it's very easy. Yeah, we're, we're, we're in good shape. Uh, I fixed the only holes I could find, uh, but I feel like there might be more because there's still plenty of water. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, we got some. Oop. We got some fires on the back. What's well, you fire? play with fire, and uh, you end up getting a little burned. Okay, so now that's good. Let me uh, let me raise our sails. Uh, left cannon, left cannon coming on them. Uh, go patch holes. I'll I'll get our mass back up. Oh, and actually, you're fine if you want to shoot him. I mean, I missed, but I'll patch holes again. Uh, oh god! Yep, yep. There we go. Oh, they uh, they just control. stop blowing holes in the ship. Uh oh. Um, we're getting quite underwater. But yes, we are. Oh, if it goes oh, over yeah. the back, then we're done. Oh my goodness, it almost got me. I think I passed the old. Okay. So our sails are good, so we can we can start moving a bit. Yeah. All right, now we can go on a bit of the offensive. Oh, okay, really? Right. They just died like that? 
Apparently we put enough holes in them. These ships used to be a lot harder. I'm just going to be honest. I, think, I, I mean, I think I was going to say it's clearly we're good, but I think you're right. I think that'll be easy. Uh, oh. I, like, you, could, you couldn't do this one player very easily. Oh, well. The Seaver says, will you be writing a pirate's tale, Casey? I mean, that's kind of what Scout's Honor has some elements to. <laughs> Alluding to in some way. The very pirate thing to do. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the giant skull in the sky? I think. Those are the forts. Those are the, uh, the, the world events. Where um, you have to defeat a whole bunch of skeletons on a fort, and then there's some mini bosses right, and right, stuff. Right. Um, they usually take like half hour, forty five minutes, and um, it's uh, it's it's a fair amount of work. And then also because it's the skull in the sky, you're really exposed. Well, I mean, because all the other players are now as well. Yeah. Um, so that and they have special chests there and everything. Uh, you may want to go a little. Oh, yeah, 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 a little closer. I'm, I think I'm out of range. I'm moving a sword in. Not that we really need this treasure. I don't know if we're going to turn it I was in. Gonna say, I, think we, I like the way we like grab the loot because we should. I think it's like programming at this point, where it's like you never leave treasure in water. Like, what are you? What are you doing? Well, if we don't, if we don't get the treasure, then we can't hold gold. I'm going to run it over. Sorry. Uh, if we don't get the treasure, then when we meet some players in a second, they won't have any. Oh, you know what? There is one off to the left over there. Is that the same one we had before? I'm just going to give him the treasure. The... Yeah, hang a left. We'll, we'll make a delivery. Right. <laughs> I think if they're going to have somebody coming up to their boat saying free treasure, I don't know how well that would go. <laughs> oh, it's the same person as before. We'd be right, right? Free treasure. Yeah, I don't know. Let's see. I can't tell. Tank required to fill grog. What's this? Pick up chest of a thousand grogs, okay? Oh, we have pick a... Oh, so... If you pick up that chest, it's, uh, you you walk around drunk. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, uh, be careful. You could fall <laughs> off the boat very easily. It's like, getting that back onto your boat is so usually a, a giant chest. pain. Yeah, it's kind of a cursed chest. Right, right. I don't think this What's is the same one, by the way. Captain? Are we get free treasure or should I yeah. blow them up? Uh, let's see how this goes. We'll offer them free treasure if they go free. Oh, this is an actual if ship. They go free, brilliant. This is an actual ship. Um, so let's see how they do. Are they running from us? Let's... Ahoy! We've got free treasure! Oh, if it's a chase to give him free treasure, that's fine by me. Hey, we're getting off. Do you want free treasure? Free treasure. Free treasure for you. Oh, he's going to go turn in. Hey, let's go give him some free oh, treasure. Um, yeah. Free treasure. That. He's going into that I'll little turn-in point thing. over there. And he ran right into it. I think he was. I think. I think we made him nervous. I mean, we were. We were showing we're here to help. We're bringing you free treasure, which is terrifying to hear. It's true. Uh, I'm going to try and drop free, out Free treasure. Free treasure for you, sir. Or madam. What's that on the back of the ship? Oh. That My doesn't look like we've given them free treasure. My bad. Sorry. Hey, hey, what? Ah, fire. Uh, lower the sails. <laughs> uh, are we fighting now? I, I mean, guess. I, the, I, I guess we the, are. The, I put the thing down. What's that thing that we use for going anchor? That's it. <laughs> They're very much liking to be on fire. Look. Oh, I got... 
Their, their ship appears to have sunk. Yes. Our ship appears to be all good. Um, I'm a little on fire. You're a little on fire, and it's like you're like spreading it around. How do you use this water barrel? Oh, I see. You pump water in it. Okay, let's do that to get some water in it. Oh, we sunk their ship, and we sunk their rowboat. Oh. And he's on our boat. Oh, he was on our boat. Oh. You know what? He had some decent treasure. I'm going to take that and turn it in. <laughs> right. Piracy. That's right. Okay. Uh, here, I guess, uh, I guess we can just drop all the stuff off at this little outpost and that'll be our, our day. Perfect. We ended up, uh, we, we had a good time. We, we sunk a lot of boats. We sunk a player. I mean, I mean, they did put a giant keg on the back of their boat. I mean, how could I not it's have shot mean. it? I was just saying, not to. Oh, I'm gonna take the drunk chest. This can't possibly go wrong. Oh, that's gonna how be fun. Hey, at least you're not, not the one streaming right now. Because that would have been not fun. <laughs> Everyone would be like, what? Uh, what? Oh, no. i got to be honest. I feel, I feel like that the last person almost felt like a paid actor. <laughs> so there's a chance of us coming across somebody with a, a barrel ready to explode. Like, you know. It all worked out fine in the end. How am I, how am I supposed to do this? Oh, I'm, I'm succeeding. Just keep swimming. Chest, uh, Just keep swimming. Yeah. Okay, that's a supply chest, and that's a okay. So none of these are. So what happens to the players? So we shot the ship, we shot them, or they died, or they left, or whatever. Mm -hmm. Does their ship respawn somewhere else? Or? Yeah, their ship respawns somewhere else. They don't have any supply. I mean, they have minimal supplies of what you get for de default. So that person may be coming back right. for revenge. Um, but uh, we won't be here by the time they come back. Well, maybe they can pick up this stuff, if it's still there. Yeah, I mean, there's their supplies are in the water. Do we have any other good treasure on the boat? Uh, we've, got, we've got some bits here. See, there's always a reason why you there's pick it. up. Oh, yeah, we got a... We got a crate of tea. I'm just going to throw these overboard. This is what we used to do back in the day, is throw our treasure overboard and then have to swim it ashore. So oh, that makes sense because you need to go up the ladder. But there is an explosive barrel right next to our ship in the water. Just so you know. Is it? I don't know if it's explosive or it is a supply barrel. Let's uh, see. On the left side, there is definitely what looks like an explosive barrel. Uh, so it's a cannonball barrel. Oh, okay. Yeah. So nothing in that one, and then that one over there. I ah. saw red and figured it was. Yeah, I don't. Oh wow, he actually had a lot of cannonballs. Do cannibals keep? Like, if we unload it into your ship, does that? Yeah, I can. Stay we on? we basically take his cannibals. So. Uh, oh, nice. Not that I'm going to stick around, but uh, I'm going to take the cannibals. Typically, what I'll do is I will also put a uh, treasure on docks like this that are supplies, because you can't really sell the cannibals. Actually, you know what? You can. Do we have the cannibal chest? We do. And it's full still. Great. You can actually sell that. Uh, but supply chest you can't sell. Right, right. So we just want to be sick on the dock and somebody can find it. Yeah, it's kind of like a good omen. I have played the game where all of a sudden I've loaded in there's like 12 supply chests on the dock and I'm like, oh, cool. Yeah. Hey, it was worth a thousand. Why not? And it gives you merchant RP. Oh, we'll take it. My brother's probably so mad that we're uh, we're streaming today, and he's not part of this. He's uh, he loves playing Sea of Thieves with me. There's a, there's a book here that's the Captain's Logbook, which I guess is their logbook. Oh yeah, that's the that's their uh, their book. So you could you could see who they are. Okay, so they they earned five hundred eight thousand gold, and their name was El Culpo. So I'm gonna claim that they weren't a noob because they were better than me. They had more money than I did by going away. Yeah. Good job. I mean, at yeah. least they were, you know, they didn't swear at us. Like the last people did. 
That's true. That's true. But they sank. The, those people yeah. sank us. So uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I was about to say they were clearly more salty yesterday. Well, they, it's it, it becomes the sea of tears. You know, that's 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 <laughs> how it becomes very quickly. All right, I'm gonna offload my supplies. So we can call it a day. Oh, Leave it for the then. next person. Well, thank you everybody uh, for joining us. Want... Oh yeah, yeah. Go for it. Do we want to fire off these remaining fireworks? Yeah, do we have anybody who wants to have any more homages uh, for fireworks? Uh, anybody uh, who donates to the Kickstarter campaign, we will shoot off some fireworks in your honor. Um, we, have, uh, we have a couple remaining. Uh, Harrison would like uh, some fireworks in their honor. Uh, I'm going to unload the cannonball. I'm going to load whatever the firework I just picked up. All right, let me let me get one too. Oh, you know what? I have a couple big ones left. Let's. Uh... Oh, you, you, yeah, you load down that because I don't have big ones. I have. Lifted. So there's starlight firework. I think that's a smaller one. That's going to be a single pop. Yep. Yep. Oh. That'll cost you a hundred dollars in the U.S. No, no. All right, here you go. I'm, I'm loading Thunderstrike. Three, two, one. Wow. Yeah, yours was. Oh, okay. That was my crap. Little unicorn. Little unicorn. <laughs> we could have fired these at that guy and made him really mad. I assume. <laughs> I assume it was a guy based on name and the appearance in the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah for, for, for. Uh, I mean, I do think that my, that person might be somewhere going. And they literally sat where they killed me, fire and fire, celebrating their victory. Um, sorry, yeah, I, I interrupted you with the idea of fireworks while you were saying very... Things like thank you for joining us, etc. Oh yeah, yeah. Anybody else uh, who joined us for this? Thank you very much for for jumping in here and and embarking on the sea with us. Uh, it's been a really fun time. Oh, oh. I think uh, we have a ship sailing towards us right now, Tom. Oh, uh, is it the same guy? Or I think it might be. I think uh, I think he's mad. Off to our left. See. Heading straight for us. Do, do we do we head straight for him? I think we need to. I mean, All right. slight encore. I'm repairing our mast. <laughs> that say? Our mast had was uh, was I'm... hanging up by one thread. I'm raising the anchor. All right, fishies, hold on. Uh, we we have unloaded the cannabis fireworks, so maybe that wasn't that great. Uh, which cannon do you want him on, left or right? I'm I'm loading the red signal flare. Oh, is that we're coming at you? Okay, yeah. Uh, any side's fine. Uh, it's probably right side because uh, wind's a lot better in our favor. Okay, uh, turn it's turn left. Turn left. Turn. Yeah, Roger. Turn, turn left. Roger. Three, two, one. Turning oh, right. what a shot! Close. You want to stay in the range or do we try and close with them? Uh, close the distance if you can. Roger. To be fair to him, he's circling as well. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut across so that it's on left and then. Not since two. I, I didn't catch much of that, but... It... Okay. Uh, basically, I'm going to try and turn sharper to get him on the left cannon, but it will close distance as well. Okay, well that's... Alright, that'll be fine.
I see you, buddy. Uh, which direction are you turning? Okay, yeah, that's fine. Sorry. I'm doing a bit of shenanigans with the sails to try and like turn quicker, basically. I have plenty of cannonballs, so just keep me, uh... Turn, turn right, turn right, turn right. Oh, he's gonna get in front of us. Two sec. Yeah. That's alright, that's alright. It's all good. It's all good, because I have this. We might be some ramming about to go on. I'll deal with our ship. Let's make sure we don't sink. Well, I'm off the boat, so... <laughs> but I, I was able to... Uh, I was on his boat for like a second. Uh, our ship is in actually pretty good state. I'm gonna come around and get you. Uh, don't don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. Uh, I'm currently going in circles towards him anyway. So. So he's going towards circles towards me too. So. I'm gonna try and intercept. straight for you now. I don't know how close I am to you though, so... You're pretty, you're pretty close. I'll try and get on there. Oh, yep. It's really hard to get onto a boat. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm turning around, turning around. No, no, you're fine, because I'll get a, I'll catch a mermaid and get back on the boat. Try and, uh, try and... I'll keep on with him then. Yep. yep. I'll be back on the boat in less than five seconds. Yep. Uh, Tom, turn right. I can't. He's not in my shot. We're just turning right, turn right, turn right, turn right. We're in his shot, but he's not in ours. I'm gonna do repairs, but you should be good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And... Bingo. Dang it. Oh, I just missed. You got him with that one? Yep. Anchor ball. Sorry, mate. Turn left. If I can dial this guy in. Are we sinking? I will check. There's a possibility. Yeah, we are a little bit. I'll deal with it. There's a crack or something? What's up? It's a Megalodon. I just 
said it rally. We took on a little bit of water. I can't see where the water's coming from. That's okay, as long as we're still in good shape. This guy's pretty good with single yeah, player. Right now. Uh, okay, I'm back on the helm. Getting some sail down so I can sail. There might be a ram in the back there. I'm on his boat. Roger that, I will keep our boat afloat. He's dead. Nice. There's plenty of, uh... holes. There, for our, our, uh, our patrons, here is a, uh... Firework from another boat. Whee! <laughs> oh, in front of the boat. Oh. The boat uh, is no I'll more. I'll be back with you in a minute. I'm just fixing uh, our boat. All good. All right, our boat is fixed. Their boat is no more. But we are getting chased by a, uh, a Megalodon. I mean, you're getting chased by a Megalodon in the water, which is probably not ideal. I like, I like the way we honorably fired a red flare to tell that person that we were going to come for them. I knew, <laughs> I Mr. knew. Tone. Next. <laughs> Sorry, I've just seen the message. It's next session has to be done in a French accent. Oh, God. I'm wearing a Spanish okay. outfit. Uh, oh, we gotta head out to see if we're gonna get this Meg. Um, I don't know if we will. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Uh, oh. Well, there you have it, everybody. Uh, I don't. I think the Meg uh, might be I gone. A, I, think, I think that's a good dramatic place for us to finish, right? Yeah, no Just kidding. What a good player, actually. Yeah, I mean, I I got them with anchor balls. I hit them with like three poison balls, and they recovered pretty well. And I was a little shocked by that. Um, the battle is is still behind us, by the way. Um, it'll turn around and start chasing us. So this might be the. It's, it's on our right. There's one hit. Two hits. Three hits. Reloading my pistol. I'm gonna assume it's right about there now. Do you get a hit marker when you hit with a cannon? You kinda do, you get a little X. Yeah, yeah. you get it with a pistol as well. You also so, get this so little like. Is, many... You get this little like. <laughs> how many players can you fit on a big ship? You can pit fit four. So if we want in the future, we could uh, get a whole galleon of, of uh, people together if we want to do uh, another one of these again, because this was fun. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'd, do it. I'd be always up for a thing. I mean, I'd have to be cabin boy again and get promoted. No, no, you're first mate. <laughs> we also we haven't seen the, uh, the true captain of the ship, i.e. the cat, I don't think. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not... Well, in, in the galleon for sure. Uh, uh, if we get my brother to play, he would, he very much likes to be the captain. Oh, nice, nice, okay. Uh, kill it. Oh, I should have hit it. Yeah, I think they've made everything easier because the, the, the Megalodon is not charging anymore. It used to charge the boat. Hmm. Look, there is also a possibility that it's registering my XP level and going, this guy is such an idiot <laughs> that we want to... <laughs> we'll keep it on easy mode. There might be some truth to that. I think my guess is that uh, they've made it harder for um, the bigger boats, but not as hard harder for the smaller boats. Uh, wow, can I just like get a escape, shot in? Basically. I 
I'll be honest, the great thing about the Eglon is it's so big it's very difficult to miss it. Hey! Hey! Alright. It's a breed of Megalodon. Yeah, there's a, they're different colors. If we got the one... Oh, his... Get out of here, shark. Um, if it was, uh, if it was the white one, I've never seen the white one in the, in the game. It's, uh, it's spawn rate is like a fraction. It's just uh, okay. incredibly hard to find and you'll never, I've never seen it in all the years that I've played this game. But there's the, uh, if you're on my stream, you can see the Megalodon in the water. It's kind of creepy. Its eyes are actually still open. It's a big fish. Whoa. And then comes the loot. Oh, and the 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 sharks. Cool. I think that's a good spot. To, we can we can leave the the loot in the water. Oh. Okay. Well, you I can mean, I drop off the boat as well, and then and then and then realize I left the ship going a little bit, but it's fine. We'll catch up. <laughs> Come here, sharks. Well, thank you everybody for joining Tree, us. Yes. Yeah, I have the I have the the trident, the Disney stick. We call these the Disney sticks because they uh, they came in the game when they introduced the uh, Pirates of the Caribbean uh, little DLC, the single player stuff. Ow! Um, but thank you everybody for joining us. This has been really fun. Uh, and thank you, Tom. I know it's uh, getting late there in the UK, but I really appreciate you. Taking the time and sailing the thieves, I've, sailing the thieves. I've really, <laughs> I've really enjoyed it. Thank you very much for having me, and thank you very much to all the three people watching. Hope you have a lovely day, uh, whatever time of day it is for you, wherever you are in the world. And I just died. It's perfect timing. Well, take care, everybody. Uh, stay alert, stay alive, as we always say, and uh, hope you're enjoying Scouts. And uh, for those of you uh, who still want to back us on Kickstarter, we still have another about ten more days. Um, but we really appreciate you all uh, supporting us. For those of you joining us for the stream, this was really a lot of fun. Uh, if you liked seeing this and you enjoyed uh, seeing us on the seas, if you want to see this again, uh, let us know. It's, it's, uh, it's kind of fun. It's something very, very different. So take care, everybody. We'll see you again soon. And uh, yeah, until next time. Bye.